That's y'all, chat. Hi. And Hi. Slappy Meat, speaking of sluts. Hi. It's me. I'm that. And I'm here for you today. Playing. Playing dicks. No, playing, well, kind of. With dicks. Mm, yeah, yeah. If all goes well. But we're back with Level Heads d and It's been a minute. It has been a spell. But we have returned. We are back. A dinosaur's tail. No. A bunch of <laughs> jerk asses tail. <laughs> I am joined by my friends. As I mentioned, I am Slappy Meats, and I'm the DM. So there's not really much more to be said, except... Hey. I'm joined by my friends. Right here. Here they are, as follows. Fatal Pierce <clears throat> is playing the Baldwin Asimar Sorcerer. Orgden Gwicht. Oh, hello. Everyone take a drink. Yeah, I don't have water, so... <laughs> Cheers! Okay. Yes! No water. Everyone quick, spit down Slappy's throat. Mm -hmm. Hurry. <clears throat> Be <our> name. <clears throat> <clears throat> we are also joined by Labrilla, playing the tiefling monk, Shadani Lavala. Hello, hello. Joe, don't work me up like that. You're not going to drive me home. Let's start the engine. <laughs> oh, your level needs to be updated still. Oh, I forgot about that. They're all level 10. I assure you. We are also joined by this, oh, this fucking gorgeous specimen with that lip. It's all about that lip right now. The lip and the shoulders. Mm. Mondoble, number three. Playing the half-elf rogue. Tobavar, clearly. Balin. Hello. It's house subdued. Mm. <laughs> Stay classy. Like Topova. We have, as well, Nansenator as the Warforged Cleric Brendrich. Three or three. It is I. Hello. <laughs> and writhing in the corner, as one might hope and expect, we have Lolo Man. That is all. No, he is playing. <laughs> <laughs> the Ganadon fighter. And relevant scene could I guess. It is I too. I'm hungry. <laughs> but say exactly <laughs> that. It's the one trait we can all trust. <laughs> hey. One one day Anarel is not gonna be hungry and we're all gonna be real worried. <laughs> you all won't be around. <laughs> hey. What happened? Happened? Uh, can I try? Yeah. Butch stuff. I Boat stuff. Uh, oh. <laughs> Boat stuff. <laughs> yes. Hmm. Uh, Boat so... stuff would be a good stream tag. <laughs> it really would. <laughs> I'm on a boat, motherfucker. On a boat. Weird stuff. Boat Don't stuff. <laughs> ever forget. <laughs> uh, I like you do okay. the weird stuff. So <laughs> we found ourselves obviously on a boat, as, as previously mentioned. Um, Tovar was uh, uh, revived from death. Unfortunately, he succumbed to his exhaustion from the uh, terrible fire devastation orb that went off in Yertar. Uh, got better, got better. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and had greater restoration mm -hmm. cast to 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 lower his exhaustion. Even though uh, he was at five maximum death exhaustion, now he's at I think hanging around about two, hanging on there. Um, uh, two, yes, we, yes. <laughs> uh, we. Got on the boat with Lord Captain Dryland, <laughs> and uh, we're going to investigate where oh, um, the the Queen Giant is being. Uh, no, she, she was murdered, and we're investigating where her husband, uh, the King, is being held. Um, mm -hmm. 
the boat they were on is a gambling boat. Uh, we know that Dryland is in cahoots with Yarder's kind of like mayor or <laughs> not really sure what her title is, but she's in charge of Yarder, the, the city we fucking burned back there. Don't look at that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't look back there. It's, it's nothing to see. Smoke. Um, but the title you're looking he's, for he's is Water Baron. Water, Water Baron of, thank you, of Yarder. Mm -hmm. And um, she's in cahoots with him, but he's not really respecting her. He mm -hmm. would, would prefer to be the Water Baron instead of take her orders and. Um, uh, fulfill their mutual agreement. He he wants to be her. Oh. Um. <laughs> <laughs> what did the egg uh, say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, our, uh, Branded Edge and and her friends are traveling from afar to to hear of the vessel that goose that lays the golden eggs, which is this boat. Uh, this this mm -hmm. casino boat, as it were, um, and mm -hmm. our investigations. We have a sneaky Shadani listening in to the captain's quarters. We have a, a very famished Anarilla mm -hmm. who's searching for food and becomes a uh, becomes, becomes a, a, a bouncer. <laughs> becomes a bouncer <Yeah. laughs> to help out Pal Ming. A and wiggler basically and a get... bouncer at once. <laughs> Get and I'm off. just gonna add to um, those aren't just captain's quarters; those are don't like be, don't be fucking those are at don't, least don't captain's tunies. Oh, <laughs> right. That's distinctly Canadian. I'll let you get away with that one. That was the most Canadian thing, and I'm into it. It really was. <laughs> My goodness. Um, in our in our investigation, um... Mondo, do me a favor. Give yourself inspiration, and then take it away. <laughs> we, uh, we, um, <laughs> we we um uh, we we interrogate yes, we, yes. we interrogate lord captain dryland and he lets slip that he knows about where uh where the king is being held the shit and <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Brandon Edge hearing that it pounces on him and, and says where is she? <laughs> where is she? Where is she? And, uh, and uh, very quickly his uh, his bound his, his psychically bound master Slurkrathel kills him with a with a psychic dart somehow. Uh, <laughs> oh, cool. No Mind idea. Bullets. I like the term. Mind bullets. <laughs> and again, we didn't get to ask him all the questions because he's fucking dead. So Brennan Edge cast Speak with the Dead to discover <laughs> You're not getting out of it that easy. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> going I'm done mother. with you. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> he learned. Oh, what? But King is being held on a ship. Um, he's being held, held aboard the Morketh, which is uh, sailing around the northern islands of the Trackless Sea. And that is where we should travel to next. And I think we went to Blue the Conch. Right? Close. Oh, we, we so teleported. We... We teleported uh, we... and got inside a oh, poison trapped yeah. chest and looted some cool shit, some stones. Oh, and shit. Oh, I forgot stole... the icon. Oh, it's fine. Oh. <laughs> and Squiggles the octopus yeah. uh, is still alive. <laughs> you just... We're going to teleport to the maelstrom. Just dropped in the, middle, in the center of the teleport circle where, where you landed. <laughs> but I think I got everything. You did. You were quite uh -huh. thorough. Hey! There was there was treasure to be had, and the, the precise details of which are largely unimportant because it's in your inventory. Because it had better be, yeah. but <laughs> it is. <laughs> I'm right at this. Yeah, but there also, uh, um, I okay, miss. No, no I, I thought I had more information, but now I can't remember if we learned it in game or if I know it from the book. So I'm just gonna shut up. <laughs> 
So <laughs> what were the questions that were asked? The, the, the questions that Brandon Edge <laughs> cast to speak with the dead were, who killed you? Slark? Slark? Slark Rethel. Slark Rethel. Give me the headaches. Slark Rethel. <laughs> Who's the head of the Kraken Society? So, Slark Rethel. <laughs> okay, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm fucking with you. Slark <laughs> <laughs> Who is what the captain is your... of the... What is your favorite color? Yeah, no. Who is the captain of the Morkoth, which is the ship that we're going to go track down? It's Thoth's drag dagger dark archmage. You did mix up the answers a little we... bit. Got a got a new one oh. on that one. What is this? No, no, no. I mean, you, you, you got swallow. a different answer this time with that question. So, oh, good. It was not Slark with that time. Wasn't three out of five questions were Slark? <laughs> yeah. The, the, yeah. <laughs> the most. <laughs> Most useful answer was the captain of the Morkoth's name is Tholt's Dagger Dark, and he's an archmage. And the least helpful is the fifth question. The least fifth question was, how do we get off the ship safely? And the answer, so helpful, don't drown. Hmm? Thanks. <laughs> really just thought about soccer balling his head after that one. <laughs> oh. Then we got loot, and now we teleported to the maelstrom uh, with Dryland's corpse and Squiggles safely in yeah. tow. Yeah, Squiggles is still a little devastated at, at uh, his bound master's demise, but he casts that teleport circle, encompassing the table, and he just beep. As you land in the, the moist zone, we like to call it these days. Moist. <laughs> maelstrom. As you land at the teleportation circle in the maelstrom, you all just, huh, and you hear just a, that faint little <laughs> amidst you all as Squiggles has landed on the floor in the wet cave. We, Tentacles in the got, wet cave. That's, what, that's all we can hope for. We, we gotta tell the princess about the, 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 the guy. King? The king is being held on a ship? Yes, the Tekken yes. guy. I'm not gonna bother you too much with moving your people around. You're in Maelstrom. You've been here before. You head your way up the stairs then? Mm-hmm. I trust... Uh, Brandy, you get inspiration, by the way. Yes! Thanks! Thanks! And a pat on the head. Oh! That's my favorite. <laughs> Where's my bird? <laughs> oh, nice. Don't worry about your bird. So, you head, up, you head on up the stairs, up. and uh, you see you see your homeboy. <laughs> your homeboy there. Shit, what was his name? Titus. 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 It gives... What? It's a day later. It's the very next day. Oh. Cat came back? <laughs> Thought he was a goner. <laughs> One was. <laughs> <laughs> but he came back. The one who actually has the... If I'm not mistaken, has the um, the mask of the... Necromancer, I believe. Necromancer. Neko was Neko, yeah. The Necromancer. Cat. The mask of the Necromancer. So yeah, the cat came back. <laughs> it's just Nyakuri. <laughs> so bummed you guys haven't used that yet. I wait. I eagerly await your cat voices. So the cat came <laughs> back the very next day. Yes. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the joke. We are here now. We're all together. The last horse has crossed the finish line, and it's at Maelstrom now. You see your friend Titus, your best best friend, best giant friend Titus. He welcomes you. Hello. Oh, you are back. You're big. <laughs> I still Sorry, am. Sorry, we correct. restarted this <laughs> I still am. That's correct. Still Come big. this way. <laughs> they are called giants. <laughs> that means. There we go. The to be oh, game is, game is paused. And, uh, pause, we can't move. Uh, pause. Uh, <laughs> there was a... Help, step DM, I'm stuck. Oh, no. This is going well. <laughs> Quickly. <laughs> <laughs> to hurry along, since I know you do have a hard eight and a half. <clears throat> uh, 8.30. Start, start time. Yes. <sighs> oh, God. 
<laughs> I'm in the ocean. Yeah. In the ocean. Oh, damn it. Okay, there we go. The ocean. Welcome to the ocean. We're the ocean. Uh, Which ocean? That we're in this. In the. Uh... I'll put you. I'll put you. I'll just drag. I'll just drag you. Just drag your whole ass. I'll clock you and I'll drag you. Since we're in this this a musical bitch. room, can can Brennadage hear if this other sister is throwing the tantrum still? It is remarkably quiet, considering your uh, the state of the last visits. Uh, wonder. <laughs> did <laughs> they I... do? Did they do what I said and remove the door to shut our ass up? <laughs> One can only hope. <laughs> oh yes, as I mentioned, some of, some of the icons aren't there, so you're gonna get a lot of voyeur, <laughs> you get a lot of voyeur icons. Uh, apologies. <clears throat> yeah. Princess has calmed down. I can't hear her anymore. I I'm in the drink again. <sighs> I die. Oh, who Tobovar? Fuck! Me I too. called you by your. <laughs> <laughs> I fucked up. Drink. <laughs> yeah, drink every time. Where are you? Where'd you go? Where I'll click you. I mean, the ocean. I had a beverage. There you are. That was more <laughs> fun than my water. Mm. You don't have rum today? No. Oh. Why is the rum gone? I do. And it's <laughs> fucking awful. It's the rum gone. It's Port Royal. It's beautiful. It's not. <laughs> but thank you. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's 11 dollars for a handle. It's not, it's not what you want in life. <laughs> uh, I put some in my coffee. It was actually kind of good. For a, I, ca I call it a Caribbean coffee. I don't know. I if mean, it's really that, good, that, that's what you do with cheap booze in general. You just cut it with stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I, I put booze. I don't in have much. Sometimes. Let's go to left. Princess Sarissa, <clears throat> we know where your father is. Princess. 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 Princess, oh, my. princess, oh, she's not here. My, my princess, princess. I, I assure you, I am. I am just. Uh, my token uh, very has invisible. Been replaced. It is. Uh, <laughs> fuck's sake. It actually no. She she was moved over here. She, so hey, look, it's her. <laughs> I might be able to change it actually. Let me see. That's Princess Sarissa. You know her. Sarissa. Big woman still here? Well, we'll about mm. <laughs> the big woman. <laughs> All I wanna do is watch it turn into a giant, giant woman. woman. Giant woman. Giant woman. woman. Okay. Oh, because I put it elsewhere. It's under level heads. Tokens. Creatures. Right? Or NPCs. Ah! Found her! She exists! Hey! Does it change? No, I didn't know yet. Token. Appearance. Can just type it in right. Level. Heads. Sorcerer looks to you and declares proudly, The level heads have returned! She does not say that, actually. But I <laughs> could only wish. I misspelled King Hecaton in my notes seven different ways. What the fuck? <laughs> Call me impressed. One of them is bound to be active. My, my head's not level, it's pretty bumpy. <laughs> my head is also a little, uh... <laughs> Didn't you use a prototype? Have the squishiest head. Mm -hmm. Prototype. Appearance. <laughs> that one. Update. <gasps> Yay. The one that matters is here. Yay. Princess, hey, princess, 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 Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, he's alive and he's in person and we're nowhere and I'm gonna let them tell you because I forgot <laughs> he's being held on the moor car I, I don't know what that is oh, it's, it's a ship it's a, it's a, it's a ship 
Who had sailing on the trackless sea. He lives. That is he lives. an incredible relief. I do not know if I could stand to lose my father as well as my mother in so short a time. I... <sighs> so, if you'll give us leave, we would uh, like to I... chase down Tholt's dagger dark and uh, free him from his imprisonment. <sighs> Take down that name, please. Imperator. Of course, Princess. Uh, how do you spell yeah. that? Because <laughs> we, we found we found <laughs> the guy we found we found the guy of the Kraken society thing and oh. we killed him dead and then we asked them questions. In I we like We didn't kill him. Slakar Slarkrithel killed him, remember? Sorry, for force of habit. Um, but... <laughs> oh but... no! Don't say that. <laughs> but yeah, so he 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 had a, like a big headache and he died, and then then we asked him questions and we found out stuff. Mm -hmm. But you can put two and two fucking together, and <laughs> yeah. this this slug rental. You say it was it was the order of the the cult of the. The Kraken, the Kraken, what, what was it? Crack, Kraken Society. Yes, it, you have verified this. That was actually true. Yes. It was, yes. And sh we should flop the corpse of Dryland in front of her. <laughs> uh, this, is, this is the guy that told us <laughs> he's oh. dead now. <laughs> I thought that was a carpet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This one. I... This is... Wasn't wasn't sure if I should eat it or not, so I was waiting. <laughs> uh, thank you for that. It allows me to at least begin to put faces to the pieces in play. This one was the one who told you this information. He is a member well, of this this society. It sounds like he was. Yes, he was. was. Of course. <laughs> yes. Yeah, once he dispelled his information, whoever. Um, his master is Slark this, this, away with him. Slark yes. Rindel, you say? <laughs> <laughs> that guy. Yeah, when he started talking, then he died. <laughs> Slark Rindel. It truly is that the Kraken Society is not meaninglessly named. That is, in fact, an ancient creature. Hold up. They're fucking storm giants. They live in the ocean. She's rolling that shit out advantage. Fuck you, Dice. <laughs> the hell out of here with that. Don't see how she wasn't raised on stories of... Right? <laughs> Slark. Some no. bullshit. <laughs> like... I guess, no, I remember. Sort of thing so, Yes, I... Extremely powerful creature. Ancient. Beyond that of likely even Ianrith. Is it herself. big? Almost unimaginably. Oh, bigger than you? <sighs> yes. So we can share. <laughs> you mean eating it? Uh huh. Huh? I, you want to share with Sarissa? Princess Sarissa? <laughs> I would be uncertain well, yeah, there would be anywhere in Maelstrom that could keep this creature. Challenge accepted? Might take her a while, but I believe in Anarella. <laughs> well, I pray mm -hmm. you do not... See but it it, it kept it captured your dad, so I think you should have a piece too. Was it the creature itself, or was it the order? Was it the society? Was it the small folk, the humans who conspired to do so? I... Well, I... okay, I'm not I'm not like an expert or stuff like that, but. 
<laughs> when 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 you think about it, the guy couldn't even say a lot before getting like super murdered with mind stuff by that thing Krathel. So <laughs> it, I, I mean, I you you would think that the guys don't really have much of a say. Ah. Uh. <laughs> That's a good, uh, you know, they, of course. a little broken, but it's a really good train of thought. He probably wasn't his choice to do that. Hmm. A creature this powerful and ancient amasses followers of a, a zealotry of which there's little compare. Those who crave power wish it for themselves from things greater than them that they do not fully understand. They made their choices. It was always their choice. Okay. <laughs> but was it their <laughs> hand? We have examined the site of my mother's murder and come to the conclusions that it was humans that that slayed her. Powerful humans with magics that she was not prepared for. And she trusted them. This Kraken society, it would seem, wove its way into the trust of at least my mother. How they have taken my father is, I suppose, unclear besides for his blind rage not allowing him to prepare fully as well for their treachery if there is threat that it was the creature itself you are assured he is alive uh, yes then I have faith as much as I can optimistically I have faith that it was not by the tentacles of Sorakrithel itself. Do you know what they want? Why did they take him? Mm, we only had five questions and I kind of blew three on the same answer. <laughs> yeah. it's, it is alright. You have you've brought plenty. You see... Is he bigger than you? Your 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 papa. Oh. <laughs> you asked the same question about Slack with Ella again. <laughs> she just... <laughs> it's like <kind of> deja vu. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> mm, maybe they want to eat them later. Yes, but... What are your next steps? Do you plan to pursue uh, this, this, uh, what was this vessel? Morkoth. Yeah. You wish to pursue this Morkoth? Do you know it's For your location? father. Yes, at Trackless Sea, Hillary yeah, the Northern Islands. Yeah, because, because we're, because we're, <clears throat> we're adventurers. And this, <laughs> this is, this is like a quest. So we're gonna we're gonna do it and get get a reward and it's gonna be food. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Have you seen Close enough. this vessel? Would you be able to describe it to me in some to show me? I know some among <sighs> you have magical capabilities. If you are able to show me what this vessel looks like, I would be able to hopefully not plunge you into the middle of a turbulent ocean. Right. Do we have a photo of it or inkling of it? It didn't describe it. Description. Yeah, we uh, we have no idea what it looks like. Yes. We know that Dolt Stagger Dark is on it. Do you know that? Uh... <laughs> Wait, we, we, we know we know we we know what sea it's on. Right? Trackless, the trackless sea, yes. I could send you to the 
check the I'm... sea, but I would be sending you to the sea. Can, right. Maybe maybe we can have, like, <laughs> oh 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 I know we can we can ask the the weird the weird room people, uh, on top of the rope ladder thing, to <sighs> get us, and we can. We can like what are be you on top of it. Talking about. I don't. I'm not so say there's nothing. so there's this this there's this cool room with like uh with like uh, a fire living thing in in the furnace and I kind of want it but that's not what this is about. So I, this I'm cool sorry. room. I'm, I'm going to have to stop you. <laughs> I'm not sure this is going to go anywhere that makes any sense. Can anyone else explain this to me, please? Apologies, but <laughs> I would really like to do my best to help you recover my father, or at least, at least find him and see him, lay eyes yeah. upon him. But I don't. I'm just gonna look around. I like, no, I don't think not what in tell the depth the you are talking about. about. Help. It's not aimlessly uh, going in the trackless sea. It's it's sailing between the northern islands of the trackless sea. It, is... it never stays in one place for too long. That is a... That might in fact make the problem quite worse. Mm. If it is constantly on Can the I... move, then that is going to be a problem. I'm but, gonna look but, back at Shadani me... and Tobovar and say, should we tell her about the dragon cult? I don't think she wants to know that we're associated with the dragon cult. Why would you <laughs> Yeah, I'm not gonna... No, I'm not gonna... <laughs> <clears throat> Tell me more, but, but we can no, still, was, but we can was, still, still tell her about, about the room have, without, tell, without have, telling her about the dragon people. <laughs> you have associations with the cult of the dragon. Not by choice. Friendly. By choice. Oh. No. Not how, people we wanted to associate with. How did Not you, pe- no. how did you come to become associated with them? They. They were nearly the, the source of a great cataclysm. In fact, it is their machinations that caused the, the sundering of the ordining in the first place. Oh, we don't like them very least. much. We, we, we just know they have an airship. And that would be very useful. But we really don't want to be associated with them. So that's why I'm hesitant to bring them up. Then why... why... Did you come to be? They did. You meet by chance. They saw favor okay. in you. As far as far as I understand, they were like, "Oh no, you're our friends, and you don't really have a say because there's a big, big one, and he said you are." <laughs> uh, they threatened us. Imperator. <laughs> I- Imperator. Imperator. <laughs> Uther, <laughs> good old Imperator Uther. He uh, he does again to Akari. He just he just leans in. Basically, threatening us. Looks looks at Sarissa with the the eyebrow raised. I know. I I know. They have given us very little reason to not trust them. They went toe to toe the with Eamrith, tr- the one who is the source of all this treachery in our court. They have... I watched most of them fall to her. If they were playing a long game, then they are even more wry and cunning than my sister's. Look at her straight in the eye. I'll give her a big smile. <laughs> you. She gestures to. She just gently gestures to Anarella, like. Yeah. <laughs> There's literally like no way we could you. play a long con with her on our side. <laughs> <laughs> I believe you. <laughs> I. The truth it, is, it this causes. Is some... It does cause me some concern, uh, but at least they ambushed us. I am concerned. Yes, they for ambushed us and what this means. They forced us. us. Yeah. yeah. They sought you out, they tracked you down. 
they must have yes how did they come to learn about you do you know i know that you have done great i wasn't i wasn't there at that point but i heard they make a lot of noise in a temple thing That's gonna be a real high DC, but we're gonna. We're gonna <laughs> if, oh, it's gonna be straight intelligence too. This, that's the best thing to do. If, I think translating mass is a high DC, no matter what. No kidding. That's not bad, but that, no, my fifteen's not gonna cut it. Not with that. <laughs> a temple. Uh, they. It would. Just gonna ask. What kind of? Uh, what kind of temple was this? It, it, there's a temple that they were guarding. A temple that. Uh, that was important to them. You did you wrong I, them I, somehow, and they are trying to get revenge. We did not know it included them at all. They are they are temples to uh, the elemental planes. They were making orbs of devastation, and we were trying to stop it. John, I'm gonna give you one little correction um, for oh, the shit. for the sake okay. of, of uh, note taking, my brain, for the sake of bookkeeping. Yes, uh, that was those were not the temples. There was a oh temple. shit! Okay. That, no, the, the temple with the 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 ice giant escorted us to when I was I have brought up okay. the temple. If you bring that up. Gee. Well, you were at the Eye of the All Father. Yes. It's where we met uh, the no, I wasn't. first gray guy. <laughs> first first Yes, 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 for Scray. The ones who combated the dragon cult in the first Ar place. Or Snag the Grim, who was with us at the Eye of the All Father. A, an honorable giant. Rough around the edges, yeah. but it adds to his charm, I suppose. <laughs> he has. He has my... too. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot comment on that. Yeah, and, and, they, and they were super awesome, uh, and because they're super awesome adventurers, and and they even talked to an oracle, and and she started to just, like she's just going, puff up, <laughs> she she's puffing okay, up yeah. her chest like this is my band, like <laughs> oh, uh, Tobavar, I'm not going to decrement you on mm. passives. You see at the mention of is is of Harshnag hot though, and you see Imperator Uther kind of lean back and be like, Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, he's kind of a baddie though. <laughs> Nobody likes daddy to daddy, you know baby. It's, it's fucking. <laughs> You got Do you two know if he likes that part, we could? Yeah, and Brandy wanted some of that. Brandy, you might have competition on your hands. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, it was so. What's everyone's passive perception? Passive? Bad. Uh, 13? Good mm. question. Where's my. I need a 15. I need a 15 to catch it. Back. <laughs> Excuse me, where'd I put that? That's Tobovar. Yeah. yeah Tobovar got it. With a 16. I like to use passives as much as possible because I got a character with a 22 passive, so I would like to set the standard out and manifest it into the universe so that I could just use that 22 whenever. Uh. <laughs> Somehow I had closed my. And actually, hand. his Seldo's passive investigation is 16. That's that doesn't come good. up much because the observant adds both. Passive investigation is weird because investigation is it always is. back there. It's it is weird. I'd use it. I'd like. I'd love to use it. Mm -hmm. I'd like to use as many. I know rolling dice is fun, but fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> but fuck it. <laughs> but fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Hurry it along. Oh, I'm gonna use your passive attack rolls from now on. No. Oh god. <laughs> That's the most boring shit ever. Um. Oh no, it's an auto clicker. It, oh god. 
I, yeah, I stopped. I stopped playing that, like, immediately. <laughs> I got, I think I got Kuthris drop, and I was like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> Game's over. Unless um, they want to sponsor us. My kingdom for glorious. <laughs> oh my god. But click the cookie. Um, it's passive on the sheet. It's next to the stat itself. I can take a look. If you look next to your, your modifier, so your oh, is twelve for you. Okay, cool. Oh, I see it now. I was so confused. The old sheet just wow. had it set on there. Yeah, yeah. Your, your passive sleight of hand and stealth is fucking fire. And acrobatics, of course. They're all 18. That's delicious. My passive stealth is 5. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if it's 10 plus your modifier, that's a 21. <laughs> My best passive, I think, yes, it is, is intimidation. <laughs> yeah, your sleight of hand <laughs> and stealth are both 21. <laughs> yeah. Your persuasion is pretty damn good, too. Shit. It is handsome, intimidation it is handsome and persuasion bitch. are my best. <clears throat> I'm very so, scurry. So Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> Harsman, Daddy, love him. Look, Batty, Daddy, we in there. Uh, <laughs> Uthar, if you needed any more reason to trust and believe that they have been working for us, at least <laughs> in our same interest from the start, what more would you need? I have, I might have a plan, let me, <laughs> let me consult my manual, <laughs> let me consult, let me look at the book, yeah, my only other idea, manual. let me, if we, consult the manual my father left behind, in case of kidnapping, <laughs> do this stuff, <laughs> yes, because, <laughs> My only other idea was to go there and get a description of the ship if anyone had seen it. Go yeah, to one of the islands. It would be helpful. There would still be a great risk. So otherwise, we're just picking you an island and left it's from random. The, the town you mentioned, it was a, what was it? It was a Yarter, yes? Uh, a Yarter, yes. yes. Coastal? Uh, or... We can't go back there. Yeah, it's <laughs> oh. Nobody it's can. The Oh, oh yeah, Yartar went off there. Yartar got cooked. Oh my goodness! It was this the or the orders the the Kraken Society's work as well. Uh no, these were the fire cultists. No, it was a very very bitchy red lady. Fire cultists. <laughs> fire cultists. You are neck deep in cults. <laughs> That's you have no it's, idea. It's sort of becoming a problem, are, are there yes. Any yeah. More that's that, that, that we should be concerned that's not, about. I'm very concerned that's about not, it. That's honest. not normal. I thought it was an adventure thing. I guess if anybody. Then we yes. got lucky. <laughs> All the cults love us. <laughs> yeah, but we killed. It's okay because we killed the red. I lady. don't know if love's the right word. <laughs> but yes. What was it? Uh, you, you said something about a, a, a devastation, something. Orb. Devastation, orb. Mm hmm. It, you might. This was have... her plan. Should we be more concerned, or if they are working with the cult of the Kraken, the Kraken Society, do their objectives align? I know I'm asking a lot of information, but this is the first I'm hearing of these elemental cultists. I, I don't know I trust. I if trust they're working person. together. <laughs> if she heard about it before, if you told her about it before, I fucking forgot. She's been busy. She's, does it? Having, does it? Does it week. matter? Yes. Because because I I've I have a feeling my our treatment is gonna be the same for all of them, no matter if they're like working together or not. It is. Uh, <clears throat> MB boy. Leans forward and uh, 
It would matter if it comes down to uh, being prepared for what they are capable of doing together. If they have countermeasures to your arrival, if they... If the Kraken Society comes to the possession of weapons capable of destroying some of your small folk settlements, cities even, of that size, whatever the Order is planning would be hmm. greatly facilitated. Well, you may have heard of one of the controlled detonations of the devices to get rid of it that happened where about a mile of ocean boiled for days. Yes, actually, yes. That caused great distress in the creatures that occupy the deep seas. I was going to so say... That's... There it was a, you know, because these are elemental cultists, there was a water um, cult, but I took out the leader of that one, so maybe that it's may good. have stopped some sort of a joining together, but it is... we haven't And he was definitely to trying to work with the earth side, because he was trying to make a yeah. must. And fire. Oh. They were trying to come together, but earth oh. and fire or earth and water were taken out, at least the leaders at that time, and then there was this, fire. This red which... lady, the one that burned the city. Yes. Has yes, been that was... dealt with. Have yes. I had a first dead? Yes. <laughs> then that is a start. That is at least a load <laughs> off your plates. If they had intentions of working together, then you have lessened that threat. If it is... Uh, how many of these elements? You mentioned uh, mud. Uh, Teresa... Ponders a moment. Mud is one of the sub-elemental plants. How many of these cults are there? What about the dumb elemental plant? Oh. As far as I know... <laughs> The four major planes. What about them? <laughs> what about them? What about them? Right. Come on. Are represented. <laughs> we've been Think through... there are four. Think there are four. Yes, four. The we'd... top plane, the we'd... bottom plane, the strange plane, the charm plane. Oh, no. The sub... We believe there's an... There's, there's so never quirky. any love for the switch plane. Right? By her. Well, that's Wind the Bay Wild. <laughs> but there is no heart plane. Mm. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, mm. That could also be the It'd be one. disgusting. Just be all fleshy and blood. Yeah, it depends on who you ask. Okay, so, um, well, I, I joined that, that particular <laughs> adventure kind of, kind of midway. But as far we as I... <clears throat> No, it's just me clearing my throat. I wasn't trying to stop you. Okay. As far <laughs> as I can tell, uh, so the water guys are done, and the earth guys, I, I don't know if they're done or not. Uh, we kind of made yes. that fire lady done, uh, and there's wind people left. Oh, did we have a wind stuff? I look at Brandy. Um... Mm -hmm. I don't believe we we have actually taken out mm -hmm. the the wind we'll cult, have we? No, we did. We yeah, did face know. off with them in town above the bonfire. Mm -hmm. uh, we have not met their leader yet, as far as we know. So yeah, the one left even, that could potentially. But... I would love even, a even history before... check from anybody. History check? Yes. Anybody, I love doing everybody, those. whatever you want to do. I would love a history check, except Anarella, I guess. I'll roll one with my minus one at disadvantage just for fun. For fun, yeah. Show me. Twenty-one. Fucking show me, there. show me, show me. Wow. There, there I had that one up me, didn't you? I got a twenty. Show me, show me, show me. <laughs> How you do that? See, I don't know shit, but I still know more than two. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> suddenly forgot something. <laughs> yeah. So where are you anyway. from? So I was like, wait, what's my middle name again? <laughs> 
Brandy. Paul. And then last name, Ben. Marvin. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. Met them? Hold on. And it tracks that oh. I didn't remember, so. You <laughs> met them at the same time that you punched the dude into water. Yeah. That was um, the most yeah. memorable part for me. It's Where's my pretty good. Brandy, the bitch get, that, Brandy that... get bit and dragged down into the water by an alligator trying to death roller and shit. But uh, Dane had a great time. Yes. Dane was just having a good old time. Getting fucked around with by... Got her. Oh. Uh, prisoners in the Great Dane. The, the Aresi? Greatest Dane. Yes. Correct. Aresi, leader of the Air Temple. Did. We met her. Yeah, Uther, please take that down as well. So there is one remaining. It's the four elemental plants, and there is one that is still at large. Mm -hmm. We do not have Although, much. Although, the appearance of this one made me believe they're starting to reform the others as well. That is concerning. We can't be sure. But it does sound like you may be the only bridge if. <laughs> They are coming after you directly, rather than simply carrying on with furthering the plans of Eomrith or the cult itself. Or uh, this is, I don't know. This is a lot. She she turns inward. She she becomes pensive, which is the signal that I'm taking my fucking notes. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Mm, she's now you know how we feel. Think you've got to use your head and think. <laughs> think but table question. When we were talking to them, did we mention Thold's dagger heart did. dagger dark by name? You did. You certainly okay. did. did. I was Which making sure, because I thought if they happened just... to know who that was, that would help, but they obviously didn't. Well, what about if I know? What do I fucking call this? Yeah, um, uh, no, I have a number. I have very handy numbers. And, oh, it's, it's, Chad's been looking at like the basement <laughs> boy you're where you at that's been down in the Brandy. basement where the food stores are were uh, oh were brandy <laughs> what okay, there you go. I'm, I'm hungry and i forgot what we're talking Hi, about talking Earth. about trying to get on the ship that's moving around but go to ship ourselves we're kind of boned to find another ship we don't know oh. exactly where it is okay, let's see. fish <laughs> are you hungry buddy numbers mm -hmm. 18 that's the number that works for me <laughs> mushroom <laughs> <laughs> is that the mic I, ooh, okay. <laughs> this cave is legal I'm sorry. <laughs> Nothing. Don't worry about that. Uh, ah, there it is. Okay. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do? What can you do? <sighs> Shit. Do you know any teleportation circles near where we need to be? Let's come to you, baby. Um, Above table, I'm, I'm going to explain for the sake that you can't fucking do it. But I was uh, hoping that she could cast Scry. Ooh! I crossed my mind, too, thinking if we knew anyone was Scry. Right, because I, I bring it up because you don't. <laughs> Currently. Well, well. Actually, actually. In our adventures, we might have met one or two people, but uh, we don't know it. 
Dang good. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Dude, yeah. You absolutely have. You don't know how it works, though. Sadly. Oh, my God. I wish have I could share what? this with you. I'm so proud. No, it's fine. It's fine. Nothing, <laughs> nothing about nothing. Just a DM. I could send him a message. Just a but DM over sharing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. We gotta call. We gotta call Anderson. We gotta come back in for just you know, just a little guest session. Uh -huh. <laughs> otherwise, Anderson. otherwise you'd be leaving Dane to me. And do you want that? No, because I know what your plans would be. Uh, you drunkenly let slip one time how much you would love to make him an enemy. Oh, don't you dare! Why would I do that? Oh, it was early on in the event here, and Slappy was like, "There's so much potential for just." You fuck with warlocks all day. Like, it's it's delicious. <laughs> and he specifically signed up for it. I was like, all right, Dane. All right, Anderson. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna write to your, write your character in such a way. You rolled fucking fire. So here's the deal. If you take a big hit to a stat, I'm going to give you something juicy. How do you feel about being fucked with mentally and emotionally? He's like, sign me up. I'm mm -hmm. like, my man. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready to be constantly like out of control of your character. So, no, it's basically like a, we're playing vampire. <laughs> I think I think he, when it comes to um, physical and emotional emotional torment, I think he gave as good as he took. Oh yeah, I was gonna say he, he really put did. me through emotional yeah. and mental torment multiple times. So <laughs> true, two his own party members, the... definitely two his own party members, and of course, and of course, you know the boy. Sweet Never boy. once sweet said wheel thing correctly. Sweet boy. Poor Esteban. Poor Esteban. Esteban. He's in a better I place now. I don't remember now. Esteban's original name. Is it Steve? <laughs> yes. It's yes. <laughs> was it was it uh, was it Eddie? Was it uh, was it Furio who gave him Esteban, or was it Dan who did? I think it was Furio. God, I love him. God, I miss Eddie too. Right. Oh my God. So let me let me see something. He who <laughs> snorted the ashes. If I sleep, I can do crying. Can you? Yeah, it's in my list. I just have to prepare it. Yeah, she's a cleric at you know level level good. Level <laughs> good. <laughs> level good. We could. If I take we off. Could take like mask your wounds, or I want to keep greater restoration because Tobovar is still fucking reeling. Greater uh, restoration is always yeah. greater to have. If I take off mask your wounds, I could scry tomorrow. You bring this up. Yeah. You bring this up, Alan. You are capable of looking in on on this. I, it, it it crossed my mind to use my meditation cave, the cave that I have used to send you to locations. If you are able to look in on this individual for whom you have a name hmm. Buster, the higher voice then that would be you seeing them and being able to see their location and being their immediate location I'm afraid it's not of immense help to me, as I would have to see it. But if you could represent it to me. You, mm. I believe, uh, I, I, I trust, Morgan, you at some point cast Minor Illusion to show her something. If I recall correctly. I have. Yeah. You can manifest uh, images with your, your magic. If you can do that and show me the ship, I could get you that. There would still be some risk, as I have not seen it in person and have not been to it. There will be some risk of not being at the exact location, but it would be immensely mitigated. Mm, but we don't know what it looks like, do we? Ooh, not maybe presently. you can find it... Maybe you can find it in per in paper magic. How would mm. uh, Sarissa will patiently <laughs> smile? If yes, 
<laughs> yes, there's slime one. This is what, uh, this is what Branded Edge has suggested. That if you have the opportunity to gain access to the magic to scry upon the captain of this vessel, you would be able to see it. As long Let's as do it. as long as your handling of the magic is powerful enough, you can. Hopefully, it is. It's still a bit of a long shot. It, I, it, I cannot cast this spell myself, but I am familiar with the workings of it. Uh, my meditation cave allows me to uh, cast a viewing eye into a place that I have seen before. Ooh, got holy water in that pond. We just, we just. Hmm? <laughs> We just the wait farm? until she. Huh? So we Tilt. we wait until she sleeps, and then we go use the crystal ball circle of uh, Clogiliamatar. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> listen, <laughs> I'm gonna break out. Listen again. I don't listen. think that's the best plan. <laughs> Something tells me that that's going to be bad for everyone involved. Yeah, and Arilla doesn't know doesn't know about that anyway. Yeah. Oddly, we do. We know. Well, we know about the, the Dargan. We don't know if they have the thing. We do know a dragon that has some eyes in the sky. Speaking of which, I have a question because uh -oh. I don't quite know this. I know Dane fucked something up for you by ripping ripping a page out of Unseen Servant. But what did you do with that spell, spell book? That was... That was, um... Zarya's, right? She's like, the shit mine, right? The, was that the giant one, or... I believe I had to learn a spell on the spot and then leave it because it was too big to carry. Yeah, there are only but so let many me rituals check my in there. Notes. Which is a shame. Uh... It's a shame because sending was in there. I know. Yeah, but it's not a ritual. I will make it way too easy. Listen, if, I have... if sending were a ritual, it's just everyone has cell phones. Easy. Yeah, I, <laughs> yeah. I have a scroll. You do. A. Yeah. I wish you could copy a scroll from a scroll without ruining it. You can. You, can. You, can. you have to. You have to go to a wizard. Yeah, they're the only ones who fully understand the intricacies of oh. deliberate weave manipulation. Wild magic sorcerer. I don't suppose. Good luck. <laughs> is it, is it, I don't suppose it, you know any you wizards, know, do you? Is it? Is it the scrolls I made you? You still have. I have. Yeah, I have. Um, at least the sending. I have to look to see which ones I have. But yeah, because I haven't used it yet. But okay, let's have a look at that. <clears throat> well, it, uh, it is, is crucial, I, I trust, especially now that this one it gestures to the pile, the heap, the heap of dryland. I take my foot <laughs> off of it and stop digesting. <laughs> <laughs> just, it, it gives her pause, she like, gestures gesture at it like, uh, oh. <laughs> uh, this one uh, what are you, 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 you sorry you're, oh grotesque uh, <laughs> it, do, it's fine do, do not let me stop you I suppose you have guessed uh, speak with dead upon it and wrong him for information tried before he died to ring him for information and then Slark with it. Ring him. I know. <laughs> through, a, through a psychic Mind connection. dirt or something. Yeah. You see. Yeah. He had a yes. headache and then died. Slark with it is now aware of your knowledge. This, I fear, puts a bit of time pressure onto yeah. us. But well, we could leave we... in the morning. That would give us the night to plan, but Speaking it would also give which, them a night to plan. You guys woke up and got down to business. 
pretty quick. Like, by now, it's honestly only, like, 2.30. <laughs> like, you, you woke up, made your rounds, you bounced a few. Well, you're preparing to bounce a few. You um, <laughs> dropped some potatoes. Time to go to the dentist. <clears throat> <laughs> Yeah, you got some errands to run. It's fine. Yeah, whatever you gotta do. It's my midnight oil. I don't want to look at this. You can sleep whenever, bro. If you, <laughs> if you have the ability to teleport beyond what uh, what the shell has allowed, has offered, then uh, you having vision upon. I'm, I'm sorry, it, 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 it is a lot, it is a lot to process, I, I, I'm throwing out ideas that I, I can hope, if... I only have, I can, I can get us to Silvery Moon, Waterdeep, Neverwinter, or here. Show me, show me, show me, how I do these scenes. I've been doing my best to... Papa Take said, if you're gonna me. hyperventilate, do it on the flame. <laughs> she... <laughs> that is actually quite charming. Yes, it is, it is no use to get flustered. If one is going to become stressed and anxious, temper that emotion towards something productive. You are the one who is able to cry upon this false dagger dark. Yes? Uh, yes, as soon as I rest, I should be able to prepare that spell. Yes. But you are the one who is able to cast this spell that would show it to me. Yes, because I don't believe... I am concerned. You don't have minor illusion, do you, Brandy? I am concerned that there's going to be a disconnect there. That I would not yes. get the actual image that you have seen. And in fact, it is quite difficult to see one's surroundings if you scry on an individual. I... I can send a... I can send... a... This is Slappy searching for the word. Augur. Oh! I can send an I. To a location with which I am familiar that would show me and watch over that location but unfortunately it is not able to show me any new locations I am aware of the trackless sea of course the ocean mm. is our domain but it is far too vast of an area the best I could do would be to plant this auger in the area and hope that it crosses my path how many how many how many boat places are there on the on the the, the trackless sea let's on find the, out the Get northern top. isle specifically mm, that's the sea of swords and there's a sea of moving ice well come to me google hmm because if the docks are in the distance then technically they're teleports <laughs> I belt <just> for you <laughs> thank you <laughs> I want to say belts of disappointment but I actually kind of liked it <laughs> Oh, oh my god. Okay, uh, no. The track, let's see, is the fucking Pacific Ocean. <laughs> what about the oh. Northern Isles, though? The Atlantic. Let's say Atlantic, then. So, the Northern Isles, if we're going to compare it, you're looking at, like, Greenland. A, a, yeah, like a strip between Europe and Canada. Like, it's... Mm. Hmm. Okay, but they, they okay, but they have to have had dealings with the Kraken people, and we know where the mama got killed, 
so it has to be like within reasonable distance maybe we can okay. like maybe we can tighten it down I will do what I can. I would recommend you consider your options. You have free reign of the castle. You have free reign of Maelstrom, my home. Uh, I would not recommend going to the Northern Tower. However, as there is some unpleasantness with my sister, of course. I pick up the corpse by the their <laughs> hair on the back of its head and it kind of put it, its face in front of Brandy and like can you ask him again? I think it only works once. <laughs> oh, Then can I eat him? Uh, I think so. Don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> if you believe that... Can anyone speak with animals? If you... <laughs> if you believe that... The ship that now... House is my father. Okay. Is one that must have had access to land. At the Red Rocks. That is a that is a rather vast distance. From the Northern Isles to the Red Rocks. But if they patrol the northern isles of the trackless sea, I will place an auger to the north of Ice Peak, which is on the outskirts of the Sea of Moving Ice. <laughs> what language? <laughs> Got it. You liked it. I did, and fuck you. <laughs> Bastard. Yeah, I liked it. All right, but I can be grumpy about it too. <laughs> that was quick. I appreciate. It. <laughs> there is, oh, there's bedroom. <sighs> <laughs> she is uh no it's my my accent it's a fun accent to do right it's it's strong enough it's so yeah. much fun i will place an auger and i will i will only hope that it crosses my path i make no guarantees and time is going to be of the essence okay 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 let's say Words. Let us say words all together at once. Words, words, words. words. Family. <laughs> Family. You did it. Discombobulate. Oh, that's a good one. I'm a fan of that one. Verisimilitude. Kelly. Kelly oh. Pidgeous. Oh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Ornery. Um. <laughs> Stellar door. That's that. Get up. Get, get, oh. get, get up. Get just. <laughs> I just took away all the goodwill I had. Yeah, right. You, you have me very similitude. <laughs> I love that word so much. V words are always, oh, they're always delicious. And that one's great because it's it's just. 
We're unified. It's a, it's a good We're make tester word. Truth. Vivisect is also good. Peristalsis. All right. Um, I was doing something. All right. We're going to say... Compared to Uther, it's been around a bit. So, let's see if... <sighs> All right. Imperator Uther is going to speak up and say, Princess, if I may, the Northern Isles, while a, a vast, while huge tracts of ocean, <laughs> huge wet tracts. No. Oh, mm -mm. No, I'm down. Um, <clears throat> Moist. If this Morkoth is constantly on the move. There is likely a at least a narrower area that it would be able to travel according to the currents. As you know, exposition. <laughs> <laughs> As you know, the Sea of Moving Ice is hardly a, a traversable spot of ocean for uh, small folk uh, only but the most daring reckless and skilled of seafarers would be able to navigate for very long if it is if they are staying there to stay on the move and keep the king from being discovered they would have to be further to the west According to the currents, I could probably... He's going to... Titus! If you could, please, fetch me a map of the trackless sea from the archives. I could narrow down the search area, at the very least. Oh no, you're actually using paper magic. Anarela's gonna be just impossible. Insufferable. <laughs> she's like, fuck yeah, paper magic, bitch. <laughs> no, she's, she's, it's still a mystery to her. Why would, why would she ever be so vain and bold and braggadocious? It's not that I don't like it, it's that I don't get it. And when I don't get it, I usually either kill or eat it. Eat it. If one and the other I trust. <laughs> well, I'd like to, but sometimes you kill something and it goes poof! <laughs> uh, okay, um... He will send Titus to go acquire a map of the track of the sea and bring it to Sarissa's attention. We'll unfold it. In fact, we'll invite anyone who is versed in paper magic to come over and uh, take a look. <laughs> it's just like that we're calling it that now. <laughs> I will join. I will look. He will show you an area on the map. Did she? Oh no! It thought Sarissa cloned herself, but it's the carousel for some yeah, reason. Yeah, yeah, the carousel's up. I don't know why it is. Oh, she rolled a, a initiative earlier. Oh right, because of the, the the fight with um, Irmuth. Now that she has a token back, I guess she's the only one who got added to the carousel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she has fifteen on the. Oh, does this begin combat? Oh, I guess she just saved her. No, oh, okay, that's fine. Weird. Princess wants to rumble. <laughs> oh, you want you want to throw hands? Hadoken. <laughs> <laughs> mm. You're presented with a map of the trackless sea. 
Uh, it is... It looks like a geographical map. Because it is mapped on the bottom of the ocean. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. It is their map. It is useful for them. But <laughs> they're aware of the of the land masses that uh, are relevant to seafarers. And, of course, they're wider at the bottom. <clears throat> oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Just like me. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, that way that way you don't lose them. <laughs> yeah, they don't spill. So he will point out he will narrow the search basically from let's see with the this nineteen he's going to narrow the search from Basically, the distance between fucking Spain and uh, and Eastern Canada. That's a, okay. That's big. Mm-hmm. This is the issue. <laughs> He's going to narrow the search down. Not bad. To about a third of that. And it'll be the easternmost third. No. Sorry. That's already kind of assumed. He's going to narrow it down to a third of that. Yeah, they're not going <laughs> to... They're not likely to have gone all the way to... <laughs> shit, what is it? Finland? Yeah. Anchorum. <laughs> yeah, Vinland. <laughs> not going to go all the way to Vinland. Oh, Knut. I mean, not gonna go all the way that way. So, what you're left with? What's what's the easternmost region of Canada? Oh, Newfoundland. <laughs> Newfoundland. Yeah. Oh, oh, well, okay, right. <laughs> <laughs> and you gotta say it with the accent, though. Yeah, I, I was just thinking of it's Newfoundland. Newfoundland, everybody. Newfoundland. Okay, so above. And by actual modern, above, modern day, we Newfoundland. So let's say distance from. Uh, Who you long to? Above table. Because uh, we're we're kind of needle oh, in the haystacking this. Um, yeah. So I had I, like two two thoughts uh, about how to go about this. Uh, first one would be finding one of the m most likely local ports and checking uh, ledgers and registries for ar arrival and departures and checking all the names of the ships. Maybe find uh, our ours and get a lead from that. Or just get the airship and fly over back and forth like i said what get, you are get some going get some to eyes. get uh from his narrowing down of what the currents allow the likelihood of that distant travel and the lack of many ports on these isles well unless it's swashbucklers in which case plenty but <clears throat> Let me ask you a question real quick. As someone whose family is in business, would these ports be a known spot that you could send your items for sales? I appreciate your chutzpah. So I'm going to say... <laughs> and yes, I did literally just go back to my origins as an Akink fan. 
still got that letter in inventory. And I, know you I do. Letter, yeah. <laughs> Prize possession. Okay. Um, make me. <laughs> make me. Let me take a look at your stats. I will. Let me take a look oh, at your good shit. Yeah. Promise. Braddy DMs. Sometimes you gotta, you know, reach real far to see what you can grab. It's I mean, would hmm? my character being from the upper north in a monk enclave know about it, or is that too far away? Let me think about that. Let me think about that for a moment. Um Actually, yeah, I do kind of like the idea of Swashfucklers taking place in the Northern Sea. <laughs> so. Uh, if only we had uh, a Joe, tiefling I'm gonna say, who knew the seas. If only, if only you could call some sort of individual who might know that place intimately in and out. Mushroom. Make me a <laughs> history <laughs> check, please. History? The DC is nothing to spit at. So, okay. How does a natural 20 hit you? <laughs> right in the prostate. <laughs> oh, so, clean up on aisle now. So, yes, um, you are aware that You are aware that one of the most well-traveled ports in the Northern Sea is Hortuga. Hortuga. Okay, here we here we go. Mm -hmm. Martin would know about that, wouldn't she? Ring a ding ding. <laughs> no, listen, first <laughs> off, listen. you. <laughs> so, what do you say about Hortuga, the most traveled? Mm, yeah. Sorry, I want to get it in my notes before jokes come in. And uh, <laughs> how do you think that's spelled? <laughs> Hortuga? My guess is it starts with an H, not a W, but... Incorrect. Yay. H-O-Umlaut. <laughs> W-H-O-R-T-U-G-A? Yes. Really, really not going to help Morton's rep with brandy at all or will listen. i mean <laughs> listen <laughs> <laughs> i've never been there myself of course <laughs> yet donny Do oh yes there? actually at the mention of hortuga probably ship some of your beer there it's not alcohol that's been trafficked There's a lot of problems. There. Yes. It's soiling green. Ideally, much of the work that is done there is consensual, safe, sane, above board. But we know how ideals work in a world like this. Shidani mm -hmm. has, has some point of reference to that. So, let's say you also make a history check. And this will... This will significantly lower the DC of that. Especially the fact it was a fucking natural 20. Like, oh god, that was so good! That's almost a 19. I saw it. I saw it caress that 19. You are aware of the problems of that place, but unfortunately it doesn't, it doesn't really resonate with what the, the activities of this particular ship would be doing. I'm aware of the reputation because other people have gone, but I've never been there myself. I'll tell you what. Would you say that? Give me give me more of a reason why your knowledge of the trafficking of humanoids to Hortuga would give you more information about the traveling path of the Morkoth, and I'll give you advantage. Flesh it out for me, and I'll give you advantage. Well, specifically... Shadani was almost 
taken in and trafficked when she was basically a child herself. So she has a, a special sort of connection towards making sure that children are not used in um, laborious positions of any sort. Okay. This is this is a fantastic and motivation. Routes. Hmm? And criminal routes would have commonality like cult yeah. or other affairs. That's what I was looking for. That's precisely what I was looking for. Also, hi, professional criminal from the coast over? here. Actually, yeah. <laughs> Sadly, you are making your checks a disadvantage, but feel free. <laughs> so it'd be just for you. Since we've done both, Mondo, Tobavar, you can make a straight roll. And Shadani, you can roll with advantage. Because uh, cause homeboy helped you out. 16 is nice. I like that. Not 11, okay. Yes. So. So with that, with that fleshing out of the reason of um, if the Morkoth is trying to avoid detection by anybody, they would be trying to avoid the routes taken by criminal traffickers. And Tovar is like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I think I might know a few. <laughs> I would love to hear Jackie Daytona explain <laughs> explain this thought process. Jackie oh. Daytona, regular human shipment? Regular human bartender. <laughs> Please give it to me. So good. I have to, I have to think this one out here. You are presented so. with the map of the trackless sea. It has been narrowed down to roughly thus far. It's been narrowed down to roughly a um, a three hundred and seventy kilometer. Column, row, uh. Trail. It's the ocean. What do I call this? <laughs> it's tracks. strip. It's strip. Sure. Channel. We're gonna say channel. channel. There we go. We're gonna say channel for this, because it, it's a channel that navigates many islands. So it's it's not like three hundred and seventy seventy-eight. I think it was. So just to like square kilometers. Because I'm strip. I always keep a map of the Sword Coast open whenever we're playing. That's a good idea. It's very useful just for reference for me because I don't have much object permanence. Sadly, it's um, it doesn't really show. No, it doesn't really it show. Does show the sea much further ice. north? Right. It shows the sea so, moving ice, which would be the um, the western end of the Northern Isles of the Dragon. Yes. The sea. <laughs> so east of that. Is where you're going to be okay, so observing. kind of between there and there's sort of an island where there's something called nice. Utter Sea. It sounds like a setup for a pun. I swear to God. Uh, no, it's just right. actually the name of the place. Here, yeah. let me. <laughs> yeah, by Tuarn. Yeah. Here, this is the tool I, I use just for oh, yeah. reference. Oh. It's super handy. You can, like, zoom in, and you can get, like, basic information about places. You can click on things and get more information. Cool. Been a while since I've fucked around with third-party maps. You can click to move. Unfortunately, you can't, like, you asshole, use Google. plant a location and, uh, like, drop it to somebody else to reference where you're talking about, but... Mm. Let's see here. Mirror of Dead Men. Sea Moving Eyes. Okay. Utter Sea. Yeah, okay. Um, where's the legend? Miles. Damn it. 378 kilometers. It's about 300 miles. My... Oh, okay. So that's right. Less than that, 
actually. It's just helpful, I guess. It's uh, 234 miles. So, map, come here. 200. 100. Okay. 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 Great. So, so for convenience sake. No, we're going to say that turn the purple rocks Gundarlin. That is kind of the the lower border of the um, smattering of isles that includes Hortuga. Okay. So imagine a couple more land masses. Some of them remarkably conveniently phallic. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. Okay, yes. So um, it's the dick archipelago. Between <laughs> but <laughs> some of the names, dude. Some of the fucking names. <laughs> uh, uh, this is the story of a girl. <laughs> this far. So let's say the distance between Arlsberg and about halfway between a little less than halfway between Gundarlin and the Purple Rocks, right? So, okay. So about, as the crow flies, west. That's the area that Uthor has narrowed it down to. You and Shadani, and a little, little above table assistance from <laughs> Lolo, that tickled me right in the places I was looking for. Because <laughs> Shadani gave me great motivation. But it was the rationale I was looking for. Uh -huh. So she's like, alright. Fuck these traffickers. I looked into the routes they take. And uh, I think that the more cost would want to avoid those. And Tobar is like, oh right. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, we are going to narrow it down further. Yay. To say. Go back. Go back to tool. 16. And that natural 20. 16. Like, we're, we're getting some juice here. We're going to narrow that down. Tobovar or Shidani? Romeo D100, mm -hmm. please. I'll do a D100. I so rarely do these. <laughs> I'll let you have it. Mm -hmm. uh, there it is. <laughs> let them out. Let them have it. Ooh. Wow. Maybe I shouldn't have. <laughs> Oof. Okay, well... I don't think I ever want to roll that on my D one hundred sixty five. Would advise you to roll higher next time. Um, <laughs> if only okay. you hadn't gotten and then lost. <laughs> then advantage. <laughs> right. Then um, we're gonna pay some insurance. What? Uh, we're gonna. Oh, sorry, hold on. Uh... Oh man, we're gonna cut it in half. We're gonna cut it about in half. So you're looking at about a hundred and what is it? One hundred fifteen. One hundred seventeen. One hundred seventeen mile strip. Anyone else has some more juice? I'm all ears. Uh, um... mm. I don't think there's any sky giants left that are in uh, Cirrus's favor, are there? Like, what would the sky giant that came to uh, to hear the two sisters playing on the crab over here? <clears throat> 
Was there a sky giant mare? Hold on. I bet I know his name. Notes. Notes. One moment. Maelstrom. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I remember the name I of know. the one that Dana and you talked to. spelled maelstrom wrong like another seven four billion times i feel like such an idiot m-a-e-l m-a-e-l oh more hits <laughs> a gift for me Mar oh right i'm such an idiot <laughs> Uh, ice giant, Jarl, <laughs> Count Val, Cloud giant, Count Val. Can he help us out as a cloud giant? He was the he was one of the guests at your uh, at your performance, your sisters. Okay. Uh, did he have uh, an eye in the sky, as it were? <laughs> Since you bring that up, we'll say could he at least okay. hold your auger so that as he's drifting over that area, you could clearly see. Okay. Okay. Make a D100 roll for me, please. One. <laughs> 35. Fuck. Hey, that's 30 more than we had before. <laughs> I can make a call. <gasps> yeah. I will cast in the with the conk with the no my gif. I can channel uh, familiar individuals and. Uh, Best communications back and forth between them. I didn't get that. <laughs> Head pats. Looks to <laughs> looks to uh, Brandy and Morgan. I can guess sending from my game. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> and we'll make a point to do that. So we will see if, see what she hears back. Oh, Janice. That will. Maybe I can yeah. scry a little closer with that, with all those combined informations. You have the name of Sol Stagertark. That is uh, yes. likely to I've heard be of your direct target. Uh, if you are aware of the identity of an individual, you can, you can cast it yes. upon them. That's lethal. Uh, we will have time <laughs> then. I it would give me great relief to advance the timetable of our movements as much as possible, but I think this is extremely helpful. We have we have a region to search, and I will hope that I can send you directly to the ship and not to drown you. <laughs> that was one of the answers that he gave: is "Don't drown." Yeah, so it is sound yeah. advice. <laughs> I don't know if would... anyone. But if I'm we're staying here for the night, if anyone has any like light work or anything they want to do, I can. I have a candle that can burn for eight hours, and you can do light work all night and still feel like you've rested. Hmm. I, I think I actually have to do a, a sleep to get my spells rearranged for it air. counts as a full you had, rest you had to <laughs> what nothing i fucked up no 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 just you had to say it like that you just <laughs> yeah. had to say it you just had to say uh, it. The, the rule book says i can't do it right <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> no. Girl, I'm trying to get my spells rearranged. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Not real uh, thrilled with the way that came out. <laughs> I am doubly thrilled that it was pointed out that I said it that way. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty thrilled because I was going in. <clears throat> anyway. Look at the word. One. We are going, then, to take our first break, and probably only break of the evening, as uh, we do have a... I keep wanting to say, we just keep having a hard eight, but it's 8.30, so it's... Doesn't quite make the sexual innuendo work. A hard eight and a half. That's what I was doing before, but it just sounds so clunky to say it like that. I mean, eight and a half is a lot to wield, let's be honest. Yeah. I can only handle eight at a time. So, we're going to take our our break for the evening. Let's, uh, let's go acquire some food, some snacks. Go ahead and grab yourself some snack. Grab a drink, grab a fap. Whatever you got to do to come back all refreshed and ready for further developments in the search for the Morkoth. The bastard. Won't stagger dark and his precious cargo before who knows what happens with Slakrathil now that he is aware of your dealings we will see you ever so shortly
positive direction in my Halloween script. Hey, everyone. Welcome back. I'm back. We're back. We're all back together. Did y'all have a wonderful break? I did. I got chicken, and I still have plenty of meat to deal with. So I'll be doing that while y'all uh -huh. discuss next steps. So everyone has taken a pass at, uh, at actions to narrow their search down. Sharissa will kindly dismiss you. Say, if there's nothing else, I will I would happily uh, reach out to my cloud giant associate. And now that there has been an understanding this is the wrong accent. Now that there has been an understanding <laughs> that there are efforts taken to restore the stability of our court and our ordering. I do trust and hope that with the demonstration of the treachery that threatens all of dragon kind, we should be more than cooperative. But I will let you know what reports I might hear back. It may also take some time. This is no small area, but a vantage point from the sky is a great boon to us. If you do believe these dragon cultists to be of use to you, I shall not stop you. I will trust your judgment on that, but do be wary of their intentions. I would caution you, as I can say in an official capacity, Friends of Maelstrom. I wish to see no ill fate befall you for all you have done for us already. For all you have done for all of Dragonkind. It pains me to ask so much of you, given that you have discovered such things, and you were the catalysts of uncovering the treachery that took my mother and threatens to take my father. But we are so close to his recovery. We cannot stop. I will do everything that I can to assist you. Maelstrom. Welcomes you. You have free reign. Still to be cautious around the lower levels where the deep sea creatures are kept. Oh, that reminds me. Um, I'm gonna lift up Squiggles. Uh, got a place oh. for this little guy? <laughs> I must have done notice that one. It is so small. Hello there. See something. Let me see them. Yeah, I don't I know if he's bad or not. He was with um, Lord Kesper Dryland here. We. Oh. They hey, shared a know. link, but oh, I, I don't know exactly what they meant. But he was fairly traumatized when he died, and then we accidentally brought him with us. <laughs> oh. That's why I was asking if any of us knew how to speak with animals, but I didn't think any of us can. No. Unfortunately, that is, them. that is not a, a capability that I have. No. Fighter can be useful. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's something you've We're seen so before. Close to this, making... this is so good. I mean. What? We're so close to making Slappy do a little octopus sound. Voice. <laughs> I have a whole library of sounds that are appropriate for tentacles. Don't you could have stopped before you said library. <laughs> hey! I have a whole for hey. tentacles. Um, effects? Is that where it is? It is. It must be. All right, fine. Um, oh, hey, we're looking at the boat. Yeah, for some reason, it's, that's the active scene. It shouldn't be. 
Oh, because I pulled you to the scene. They were on a boat. But didn't make this one active. So. It's not the most helpful. Mm -hmm. It's not the most helpful. But. Uh, because of over the table observation, you know that Imperator Uber has something in his possession. With Bill? Comments were made. <laughs> it's, damn it! Stop doing that. No, if you don't remember it. I was gonna say, it's fine. I don't think I took a note if we heard it above board. Okay. <clears throat> Sadly, I cannot communicate with this this creature. Ah. And Dr. Uther, is there anything you can do with this? I could dominate its will, but I don't think that's going to be of much use to us. Oh, he has a trident that has fish command. Mm. You took that note? Ah? Hell yeah, you did. <laughs> Hell yeah, you did. Oh my god. You can, t can, can, Uther, can you tell this guy to let us know where the ship is? Like, do you think he would know? I don't know. But how would it communicate with us? Holy shit. The map is right there. <clears throat> Nancy. <laughs> yeah, what? Bitch. <laughs> Here he go. O octopus cry. <laughs> yeah. So that's an attack roll, but uh, uh, show me the stuff. Uh, just give it. He doesn't kill it. it <laughs> he doesn't. <laughs> he doesn't stab <laughs> it. He. Uh, I'll use it. I'll do it if you give this information, they'll give you a nice place to leave. Show. Try it in the fish command. Does this show to you guys? Okay. Um. Look. Huh. Spellbook? Mm. He doesn't have it with him? Fish command. Is this equipped? It should be equipped. Hmm. Why doesn't it add the spell to him? Okay, mm. let me... Uh... Pardon me for a second. I must attune to this real quick. <laughs> <laughs> give, give me a post an hour. <laughs> it's um it's ten of time maybe. Let's just slap this into a fucking spell book. <laughs> just, boom. It cast it oh my god. Just cast it at its own level. It's the weapon, it's fine. No, don't consume the spell. Just doesn't have that slot. It's from the weapon, dummy. Yeah, no, Dane isn't here. We don't need to consume spells. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Literally. So, dominate beast. Let's uh, say... Action, Ank! This time we saw you, you were left in the clutches of the giant octopus. That sucker was a up. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big... There he is! <clears throat> All octopus stuff is still just reminds me of it's Lassie is No the Boys. Yeah. Poor it's... Timothy. No, wait. No! Say less about that. <laughs> it's a family. Don't... What did I say? <laughs> <laughs> Such a fucked up scene. It is! It was effective. Let's try to do less fucked up things. <laughs> this this squiggles here um squiggles. sorry i'm actually <laughs> his yeah, i didn't change his name his name is not squiggles oh it doesn't show appearance identity squiggles display name hovered by owner no 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 always for everyone <laughs> squiggles <laughs> 
It's his octopus! What the fuck? It's his octopus. Bitch, I told you. Bitch, I told you. It's Quiggles. Quiggles. It's Quiggles, dog. Oh, it's for everyone. It's a belch of Squiggles. Belch of and for. Squiggles. Squiggles! Everyone sees Squiggles now. That's him! Hmm. He's going to do a thing. He's going to be great at it. Is he going to point on the map? No, he's going to make a wisdom save. Oh, he fucking saves! <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Hold on a second. So Let me look at my sheet. So just like thrashes about in your hand like like, Do we know what he had to beat? Recoil. <clears throat> Let me check my feet. You don't necessarily, but I'm gonna tell you. You could change it. Oh, fuck. You could. You turn could potentially. Luck? You could potentially turn the tables on this one. Yeah, I can bend luck and roll a one d four and give them give them the penalty. So let me take off two uh, <clears throat> sorcery points. And. I did it. It's just, it's gonna show. <laughs> there it is. Oh, Squiggles said it. He said. Try to the fish command. No, he didn't say that. <laughs> I don't believe that he said that. And he did. That surprises even me. Only English he knows. <laughs> common. Or common. <laughs> There's three charges. When you carry it, you can use an action. Then one charge. Because, okay, so you can try it a few more times. But you say, you see Squiggles be like, whoosh, and like latch his tentacles around Brandy's <laughs> hand and she's like holding him out. He's just kind of like gently doing his namesake. He's doing, doing some Squiggles until the spell was cast and he went, whoosh. And then Morgden, you're like, give him that little eye narrow. <laughs> Uthor says, in giant, which, um, Morgden, you understand. I know. Yeah. You hear him give the, the command now that he is domi dominated. <clears throat> Show to us on this map the location of the vessel that your late master knew as the Morkoth. Now here's what must be done. This is an octopus. Mm -hmm. I don't believe that three is fair for an octopus. That is his, his intelligence score. I don't buy it. Octopi are much smarter than that. So, I'm gonna change that. Yeah, it's an octopi. It should be at least 3.14. Um, so mad at you. <laughs> <laughs> Hate it. You're more happy with <clears throat> Mondo than what I would have said. <laughs> I'll trust you. It wasn't the worst. <laughs> Math jokes? I'm okay with that. But but also, damn you. <laughs> that a line, but he's right. So anybody, any, <laughs> anybody but Joe, what quote. do you think the intelligence of a small child is? Zero. What's the scale? What did I just fucking say? Hundred. Your average adult is ten. Oh. Child? Oh, wait, my yeah. my brain went to seven. Stat wise, you like yeah, seven. Yeah, they're they're not. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say like a seven or eight. Like seven. Benny's eight. What's Anarella's? Just out of curiosity. Eight. Actually, I think that bitch is smarter than Benny. Intelligence of eight. No, it's eight. Okay, okay never mind. They're the same. Seven it is. Octopus, you get seven. That's funny thing. I was talking to, funny, to but maybe... Impulsive. Hmm? 
<laughs> I was thinking Fenny and Anarola are very impulsive, and they don't have the intelligence to not be impulsed at every moment. Well, maybe they do, but they don't want to, because being impulsive is fun. Mm -hmm. Fun is fun. <laughs> not when it's about to get you killed. Greta out here oh, like, excuse no. me. <laughs> Rocking a solid four over here. <laughs> Or oh. look, look right. <laughs> for long or for the round? <laughs> oh. Friction on a pickle jar. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm already snacking. Don't make me hungrier. <laughs> no. No. Now's not the time. Okay. So we're going to make a check. Our good boy Squiggles can make an ability check. To you see can do it. If it understands. Anyone trying to do something? I mean, uh, rolled a five. The highest I can get it to is a nine, and that's if I'm lucky. Wait. Lucky. Can I guide him? Actually, yes. Touching him? Yeah, I guide him. Okay, you were the one who asked in the first place. So you'd be like, you got this, buddy. You got this, buddy. Got him. Okay. We'll add that. I will also note, inspiration's pretty powerful. <gasps> I can re-roll his inspiration? There are... Mm. It doesn't only count for me. The stuff I do. I believe a tradition... Now I'm thinking of portent. Mm. I love portent. Let me see if there's a precedent for this. Pulling full <laughs> full lawyer. Let me call up. Uh, let me call up Jeremy Crawford real quick. Get my boy. AC. Question. Say, my boy. My, my man Jay Critty on the horn. Jay Critty. <laughs> <laughs> Damage rolls? No, 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 no. That, uh, wait, hold on. The player's handbook gives the option in advantage on attack rolls, saving throws, ability checks. Using inspiration. If you have inspiration, you can spend it to make when you make an attack roll, saving throw, or ability check. When you. Gives you advantage on that roll. Okay. Just dial up Brandon Lee Mulligan real quick. Ask him. <laughs> Fuck it, this was your idea. If you want to spend an inspiration, do it. Fuck yeah. Squiggles, I believe in you. I like this idea. This was... Can I... This I'm is cute. roll d20 for Squiggles. I'll do it. Fuck! Excuse me. Sorry. I said I'll do it. Yes, you did. And uh, you're welcome, because <laughs> that was awful. It was. <laughs> it's, plus four. It's not stellar. And you have plus four. Cause you did a little guy, did a little guy, guy poop. So, hey, we're at a thirteen, and it's still not passing. Cause I will dump two more. I'm gonna dump Listen, two. I, I feel comfortable saying about table, the higher the number you get on this, the better. Yeah. <laughs> the better. So let me just. This, this go. is degrees of success we're talking about here. That's uh. Helpful. It's I'm more success. Mm -hmm. So mad. <laughs> 14. 14. Uh, can I do anything? Else? That is enough to allow it to understand the question. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> if it were the five, it would nothing. It was like, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm an octopus. What do you want from me? You are. <laughs> I'm an octopus, eh? <laughs> what the fuck you want? Oh no, it's Wado the octopus. Oh, that's what I do. I was thinking it's the ball. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so that's, what, that's what you. 
Right? Yeah. That's the one, right? Yes. So Balba was the... Playboy. Yeah. That owned Anakin. Yeah. No, that was Watto. That was Watto? So Balba was the, the guy he raced. Oh. Oh! No. Fuck me in half then, please. So, so Balba's the one that said he's gonna be Banta Pudu, but he never spoke in common. Mm. Bitch. So, 14. I hate that I know that much about that movie. <sighs> me too. 14. He's going to flop himself down. He's just... Blink. You know, just like try to... I'm out of your hands. He's having a kind of a hard time if you want to lower him down. You can certainly do that. Um, yeah, he, I mean, you cast funny. guidance. So you're like, here you go. And just, so he just yeah. slaps his little tentacles. Okay. So you all been kind of like tracing around this map. Mm -hmm. With a 14, there is understanding of the question. And there appears to be some recognition of the knowledge since this master was bound as a familiar tends to be not exactly familiar but close enough mark didn't you understand this you understand that there's a shared yep. a shared a shared sense, connection consciousness least. dealio yeah hack and see so we there's some talk to each other some octopus memory dealing with that and as we all know, Octopus and forget. So. <laughs> we're going to say, what were we down to? We were, uh. We were down to about. About 117. 17. Hmm. Brandy, I like your juice, girl. Yeah? Romy did 100. Oh, fuck. Here we go, boys. Oh. Woohoo! 88. Oh. Execute order 88. Motherfucker, <laughs> that's the number. And we all die. You cut, off, you cut off 88 miles from your search radius. <laughs> fuck yeah. So you narrow it down to like... Yeah. What? 37? <laughs> At, in a row? 29. 117 to 88. Oh, 88. Sorry. Mm -hmm. yeah. 29. So he just slaps a little, little tentacle. Just like. Pfft. With a little sass on it, puts a little stank on it. <laughs> right here. Like gives his little, little eyes just look to uh, Luthor. Just that one finger. Pat, pat, pat. <laughs> oh, Good. I was head pat. You now have narrowed it down. Good roll. Good roll. <laughs> you have narrowed it down to 20. Was it 29? 29. You have narrowed it down to the number that you have set. <laughs> you have narrowed it down to that area of search. That will greatly influence Sarissa's uh, communique. Good thinking. Glad we brought that octopode. Who's that Me too. Squiggles? <laughs> yes, it's you. Great. We can come back and visit him anytime. With Orville Sand Giant. Hmm. You can say. I was going to say, go with that one. Point to Titus. Titus, take, take this creature. Hold on. He's been like on brandy and then the table and stuff, right? Yeah. Squiggles. He just pressed his, his uh, the squiggly squiggles. Mm -hmm. Squiggles. All right. Then I'm gonna uh, just briefly use prestidigitation to mist a little water over. Oh. 
Lovely. He likes to be yeah. moist. He's been out for a little while. How nice of you. Okay. He helped us. I was going to say... Positive reinforcement. You don't want to know what it would have done if he would have not helped us. <laughs> At least it's pretty moist in the air here, too. Yeah. It might help. What's that called? No, it's just a short pen, isn't it? Um, put this one in my quarters. I have... Uh, I have space enough for a small tank. This one has been... Help, whether it has liked it or not. But... It is a... Smart creature, I would like to see it in a better place. Bring up a tank to my quarters. <laughs> Tides will do that. Oh, no. Heck, little squiggles. He looks real small in their hands. Mm -hmm. He's not a tiny octopus, but yeah, it's like enough to. It's in your shoulder, it's kind of big as your head. But yeah, with a giant. No finger. He's got him wrapped around his finger. <laughs> Sarissa will then, properly, bid her leave of you. To go <laughs> play some phone tag. What do you do? You're being given free reign of Maelstrom. I'll guide uh, Anarella Ooh. down to the storeroom. <laughs> she said we'd have complete run of Maelstrom for the day, so let's uh, go get you a bite to eat, little buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we need to RP exactly how we know that that's going to go. That's going to go. Mean, we're, we're gonna... In my head, the reason Anarella's been quiet for so long is because... She's eating the yeah, captain. Yeah, she's eating dryland. <laughs> Just, mm, mm, mm. So in my head again, she has like a full skeleton inside of her that looks like her skeleton now. <laughs> Cookie scary slime girl. Halloween, okay? <laughs> Never. <laughs> it's still pumpkin spice season, damn it. We have not been overtaken mm. by the mint yet. Yeah, it's mint season. Sorry, but it, it, this is like the in-between mint and pumpkin spice. Oh, when are you going to set up your candle so I can rearrange my spells? <laughs> um, I was going to say, like, bedtime, basically. We don't have to sleep, so we can just sit for eight hours. Mm -hmm. We'll say an hour has gone by during this so conversation. I figure... About 2.30. We can, you know, probably get some food. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys better eat before <laughs> Anarella gets there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Sultry's here. Hi. Uh, is there anything anyone else needs to do? Rest. <laughs> yes. I mean, not necessarily, oh. but I'm sure we can find something to keep ourselves busy. I mean, it, we have... How much time do we have before we would need to sleep? It's only 3.30, right? Yeah. So if we eat, call it 4.30. Hey, ho hold on a second. Hold on a second. You can definitely, like, rest and kill time, but, like, properly going to sleep? It ain't easy. Unless you're a Trust me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, but... <laughs> We're not actually in a sleep. We just need to know when we need to go to sleep so we can get out. Oh! What if Tobovar rests in front of the candle and then sleeps? Yeah, we brought that up. Yeah, that sleep idea. in front of the candle. Yeah. I think if we do both at once, maybe. Yeah. I like that. I kind of like that. It'd be kind of cool. He's um, not like I said. Who transits for six hours instead of sleeping for eight. Mm -hmm. So yeah. that's helpful, I think, as far as consumed time. Um, and then what we're able to do during that time is up to DM. It says the wording is like light. So study. Um, uh, yeah, study, reading. Study, study, so study, probably study, not study. 
probably not actually doing your skills. Study, 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 study. Uh, but I, I think I can do my reading. Engaging yeah, you're light not, activity. You're not going, reading, studying, you're not talking. 16 men. No, uh, you, what the hell was it? You, you're not going to do 16 men, I think. I could do 16. 14 then. Yeah, but that's not light work. <laughs> it's at least moderate. 14 is light. <laughs> and you just have to be within the light. It doesn't say if you need to be within the bright or the dim. So I would say those of us doing things maybe in the bright light that's within five feet of it. Those of us trying to sleep through it maybe closer to the eight foot in that area where it's dim. But that's for later. Hmm. After I eat and the times leading up to that, I'm probably gonna actually Can do I... stuff before I study. Can I poke around, like, up here? She said we couldn't go downstairs to poke around. She I wanna said, go see what's up She said with... be careful. Be mindful cranky of the places where... Sister. Hmm. Where the, uh... I'm gonna check up on Cranky Sister. What's she up to? She did also warn you don't do that. Don't do that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That was the one, like, specific thing that she said don't do. That was the one thing. Specific. Oh, God. We'll just to just remind you. <laughs> we did. We looked around northwest a little bit in this area because we got a tour. We did. We didn't really tour around the basement, but she also said be careful because there's creatures. There's some bullshit. And Shidani has seen that there is a deep swirling well, which gives this place its name. Yeah. <laughs> A maelstrom that you don't want to get swept current. up in. One might, one might consider that to be a less than favorable idea. I wouldn't recommend. Given the detritus, the shipwrecks and skeletons of old vessels that were hmm. strewn about Is the bottom. Still in the room? Can we? Can we yeah, like yes. fan girl over Harshnag? <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> what you got? Oh my God, Uthor. <sighs> no, you know Harshnag, but have you ever seen him hunt a mastodon? It is poetry in motion. <laughs> I um, I have not had the distinct honor. No. Oh, can I regale him with the tale? No. Oh, no. We were in the mountains. Good morning. Lolo seems to have reappeared. At least it sounded like it. Unless kind someone of. just came in oh, to speak him up. Oh, wake up. Oh, wake up. Lolo, come back to me. <laughs> Can I regale Uthor of the, uh, of Harshnag's, uh, tale of hero heroism? You have two choices. we are in the mountain. Yes? You can do it. For me. Or you can mm -hmm. roll a persuasion check. A performance, rather. Oh. Oh. You can either uh, do it. Okay. Or you can roll a performance check. Uh. <laughs> uh. He was so brave and cunning. And when he was with us in the Eye of the All Father, oh, he had. <sighs> It crushed all the monsters around us. He helped us hunt the giant mastodon. Uh, <laughs> he wanted to, he wanted to test out our hunt our hunting skills. He did. So, as as we came across six mammoths, and we brought uh, one and a half back to him, uh, he would <laughs> des uh, expertly dexterously skinned the beast. Oh. Muscle rippling. <sighs> the, <laughs> the kind hand almost. Oh, it just gives me palpitations. And I look over. Character, <laughs> that... character, okay. Is, is... <laughs> <laughs> slap his reactions. Is See, he's just. Is, is... He's a. Uh... Yes. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. <clears throat> 
trying to compose himself. Like, what's your passive insight? Uh, <laughs> passive is thirteen. Yeah, easy. You see, he's trying to like keep himself composed and professional. And he's just, oh, that is it. It's it, a it, it, it bold and brave tale. <laughs> Told that is. Uh, I I heard I'm... that he is a quite a formidable warrior and hunter. Ice giants have a re reputation for being uh, being bold and brave hunters. And have you ever swing? Have you seen him swing his? Gert's axe with a blue magic light glistening off of it and it shining <laughs> off of his perspiration. <sighs> I, uh, <laughs> I, I, I am not. I, 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 I should like it to someday. <laughs> we should all hang out. <laughs> Do, 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 do you know where he has been since the Eye of the Old Father? Uh, yes, he told us that he would be in the area as we left. He's still at the uh, temple? The temple. Yes, in, in, oh. within the area. He does have quite a, a large berth. He's got a uh, cave he has, uh, nearby. Sorry, he's what? He's a cave nearby. Uh, no, uh, where... Berth. Oh. I, I... <laughs> sorry. Yeah. I'm blustering. <clears throat> I think I must have misheard you there. <laughs> also, I got a little luck, and yeah, uh huh. It's everything you've heard and more. His composure falls. That talk about that. <laughs> talk about that harsh dick out there. You talk about, I'm talking about that fucking that grim meat. Yeah, he's like grim meat. Uh, oh. <laughs> That's it's most. Uh... <clears throat> how how did how, how did you how, how did you see this? <laughs> did... Oh, well, we we spent the night together, all of us, in his uh in his cave. He took uh, all of you at what? Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, what, uh, with this old... true gentleman, a true gentleman. When this ordeal is over, I... I would not mind if we had broke bread together, I think. <laughs> well, absolutely. I think now the expression would be like... Oh god. The expression would be like, comb the coral together? Which makes it sound <laughs> far more lewd. <laughs> yeah. I, I get you. I get you. <laughs> I know if it helps or not, but... You could see him, uh, you know, flexing his pecs through his armor. Yes. It strained his armor when he uh, flexed his lats. Oh, fuck. <laughs> see, his, see his forearms, like, bulge as he's, like, holding his hands together. Like, in, in a professional capacity, he's just like... <clears throat> <laughs> oh... Donnie, I think you uh, you sketched a, uh, a photo, not a photo. You sketched a drawing of him, didn't you? I try to sketch everybody we meet at some point. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> probably didn't sketch his, you know, nude body. I, I did not have a nude model this time. No. <laughs> you do it. You are an artist. Yes, um, I like to uh, journal and paint. I. I... <clears throat> and and uh, in a fiction auto, a, a portrait sure had be more than willing to observe some of your work of Harshnag. Or I also have a great one of this genie we met once. Oh, that's nice. Uh, do you have the um? <laughs> 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 the genie was really good. Like you're you're drawing the genie is really fucking good. He's like, oh, that's nice. Do you have? Do you, oh, <laughs> do you have one of the dock lady? The dock lady? Dock. Yeah, the dark lady. The dock. Oh, dark. dark. The dark lady. With the boots. I think 
I did. Never aim. I know I, I definitely Never got aim, yeah. the yeah Never with same. the wings. I definitely got her. Cause I remember that one specifically. Do you do you produce this? Oh, yeah, I'll pull out my sketchbook since okay. it, it came out. Oh so yeah, just you go through your, your collection, go through your little portfolio here. Just, uh, <laughs> who, who's this this dark lady? She's not a good person, but she had amazing boots. Did <laughs> have amazing boots. The, the fashion, the fashion on this one was worth noting. Yeah. Actually, why I was asking because Morgan wants to copy those boots, sort of. You <laughs> <laughs> want it for the boots? It's gonna be a pretty high DC, but yeah, you're going to make. <laughs> a curious fashion. It must be a, a, a small folk tradition that it's uh, not entirely in keeping with our aesthetic. Imagine giant in high heels. <gasps> Can't I? Oh, yes. <laughs> you guys haven't been? Uh, yeah, what? I was like, so me? <laughs> Giant in like stripper shoes, getting those extra have... inches. Are you, are you telling me? Well, on a giant, it wouldn't be inches. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Can't just <laughs> me. <laughs> yeah, there's talking. Anyway. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's my new fetish. Hey, um. <laughs> pays attention to your, your sketchbook, but uh, definitely lingers on the art of Parshnag. It, it would be wonderful if we could make a connection after this ordeal. It would, it would be a, a very. It would be a great boon to our court to have such a powerful and honorable ally. Absolutely. Mm hmm. <laughs> Stocking is missing. Anything else y'all are doing? Uh... <laughs> For sleep, I'll probably just chat with Ulthar and see if there's. Uh, any, I want to hear Ulfar's Ul war stories if he has any. Oh, interesting. Give me one moment. Hold on. Okay, yeah. now they're stalking because I can't be asymmetrical. That's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Pause. D DM has to get sexy. More sexy, excuse me. Oh, I did want to ask uh, um, Nancy above table. Did I, did Morton make the seven uh health potions for brandy okay. Ooh, uh right now i don't I think think yes because i have a whole bunch of them hold on okay then i, I will adjust my right notes because i've got eight then right i will now. adjust my notes because i did not say that i had them done okay. that will affect hmm. I got a, that will I got affect a lot of them. what it's been yeah i i thought so but i didn't have it in my note for some reason Look and see what the when that happened. Okay. Jules. What? Jules. Potions. Uh, no. Potions? Uh, health potions. Brandy had bought um, ingredients for seven health potions. Oh yeah. Yes. Um, that I was gonna yeah, put together did. for her, and I believe I did. There was. Yeah. Time. Okay. Yeah. There at some point. I thought I so. I just hadn't. That happened. I assumed it was just me fucking up my own notes. I'm so probably... I won't spend Johnny, the ahead. day doing that. Johnny, go ahead. Oh, I was probably going to, um, yeah, update my sketchbook and draw some of the other people that we've recently encountered. Probably draw the boat and. Oh yeah, yeah. Our poor deceased captain from memory. <laughs> Stuff like that. So... Yeah, let me have uh, you know the the good old. In fact, I think you can just do a roll from the. 
the painters. I thought I just did. Did it Spl not do it? I? Let me try again. Oh no, it didn't do anything. And it's using your dexterity. Oh. Good. I mean, it's a plus eight. I'm gonna say that, that your your focus at the moment is um is a vis is a is a not vista a um a sequence. It is mm -hmm. a series of scenes. So the attention to detail upon each one of them is not exceptional, but it is It is representative if impressionistic. Of I feel like I'm not into it right now, hmm. but I'm getting what I can. So you got the boat, you got the captain. Yarter. Squiggles. 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 You got squiggles. Poor Yarter. Yeah, you got the <laughs> That's the most dramatic, and it works very well impressionistically. This this orange yellow to orange smear across the night sky blending into this this choking smoke underlit by that yellow light reflected off the water in a harsh stroke beautiful tragically beautiful absolutely squiggles doing a doing a squiggle doing a little flop <laughs> like flopping on a map you didn't you didn't bother with the details of the map because the map's the map I'm the map. I'm the map. So you didn't bother with the details. So you just kind of shorthanded the details of the map, but you have a little. You have a little like motion smear of of the, the tentacle flopping. <laughs> a vaguely and anatomically correct island. And... <laughs> that's the one. It, that's yeah. It's like it, you got the kind of three quarters view, and that's like the vanishing points going that way. But like just behind the Boca is this. <laughs> this strangely in focus <laughs> island <laughs> oh we're talking about the area around the devil's dick <laughs> it's what they call the area everyone knows it. <laughs> you might actually be right <laughs> it's been a long time let's just say you are I'm the DM what I say goes perfect <laughs> devil's dick and who doesn't love a devil's dick come on I mean have you seen Raphael on BG3 anyway so <clears throat> <laughs> Morgan says that with um <laughs> probably deception because <laughs> nah, she didn't. doesn't know mm. but confidently is what I was going for that's a word I couldn't summon yeah fuck it go ahead confidently Roll says for this me. <laughs> Just roll, roll it for me, cause I, I want to, I want to taste your big numbers. Why is this not the active scene? Oh yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, Nineteen. That's a, that's a nice number. I. Uh, yeah, you, you, you know about some devil's dick, homie. <laughs> We're not really gonna go anywhere. <laughs> you definitely sound. We like didn't you really know about ship some stuff dick. there. What do you mean you don't ship the devil's dick? <laughs> Uthor will um, regale Brandy. With a story of the time that he and a an investigative force that was looking into disturbances in the south eight nine years ago he titus two other guards two of the other other giants um one of which is no longer with us sadly in an unrelated incident two days before retirement <laughs> Mondo, roll a d10 for me, please. Oh, no. That's the wrong button we need. Mondo's too exhausted for this shit. <laughs> oh, one day one. before retirement. 
<laughs> the, very, the very next day. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it was very sad. Uh, the, the the previous guard lieutenant. Roger Bertal. God damn it. I know what you just did. Yeah, you do. <laughs> he always he always said he was oh, this shit. He always said he was far too deep into his years. It's too old for this. <laughs> we ancient for this feces. <laughs> Okay, I like that one. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one a lot. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh my God. He tells a tale of them encountering a remarkably powerful and unreasonably, irregularly large. <laughs> army. Of murlocs. That appeared to be training. Oh, fuck. They appeared to be training um, large sea creatures for their use. It's unusual uh. because they don't usually use mounted tactics. But through great valiant effort, these three intrepid, and bold, and brave storm giants routed the Murloc army and found that they had been in service of an abyssal deity that was wrangling them their uses for oh Anaril is so eepy Anaril is so eepy so eepy oh my god wake up it's too late grab a brush and do some things <laughs> Uh, Murloc Army, Bethel Force. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I was trying to remember the name. D and D. Nothing to do with the, uh. Oh, no, it's different. No. Oh, no. Oh, we have to say it's like uh. A, it was a, uh, a, a sub servant, a, a lower level a duke of Therestun. Actually, you can definitely make a religion check okay, okay, yeah, about that. I can. I'm good at those. I think I am. He will name this uh, this this lower oh, level deity, this this demigod yeah, as um. Well, you're good. Uh, what's your um history modifier? Because I would accept that my too. My history, my history is big. big you don't big, have to. Big six. You don't have to re. Six. Okay. Hey, you didn't. Yeah, you have to re-roll it. Let's take the the first Sorry. roll. Because I'm a good boy, and um. Me. To that Remember that when, when I'm kept. Uh, <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> so, Fuck yeah. 24. Yes, great. <laughs> he will name this lesser deity as Barnak. Oh. With a K, of course. Okay. Of course, obviously. What do Thankfully, no glottal well. stops. I was considering it deeply, but no glottal stone. <laughs> Just bar knock. Right, no little bar knock. You know that you have heard not very much about Barnock, but 24 is great. 
but you have minimal knowledge of Barnock. You, uh, through context and through what you know of what the role was actually for, through what you know of that, Barnock is. Barnock has been said to be a, a nuisance. A a mid-level player in the Blood War. Who, it would stand to reason, was trying to amass deep sea forces for the Abyss. Murloc, typically tending to be aligned with the Abyss itself. There is doom. You know. Come back. Hey. There is Dune, you know, to be the god of destruction who created oh. the abyss and was imprisoned in its remote lair during what is known as the Dawn War. A conflict about as old as time. A lot of dish soap. <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> <laughs> A war that was remarkably gentle on the hands. Hell <laughs> as old as time. <laughs> there is Dune is... A name so superlative as to be almost beyond alignment. Like an, an evil beyond a measure. An evil beyond compare. So those in their in service to Thera's Dune are numerous and belligerent. <laughs> but almost intraceable in the chat. Yeah. <laughs> but almost in <laughs> intraceably connected to Thera's Dune itself. With twenty four That brings to mind something from long ago. Your master, I frustratingly named Asterian. Asterian? Yes. Asterian? God damn it. <laughs> Why is that frustrating? Just because I, I didn't play <laughs> BG3 at that point. And I swear to God, it was, it was completely Hi. independent. No, no, no. It's <laughs> cool that my master is hot. We're fine with this. They're differently hot, though. They're, they're hot in different ways. Okay. <laughs> They're both elves, but yeah. one's got more density energy. One's definitely your Asterian has far more density energy. Far more. You want me to show you again? <laughs> but you, you, you were made for so much more. You are mine. Yes. That's fairly. <laughs> Anyway, what were we talking about? So, Abyss. Um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> you realize in the mention of Thera's Dune, click. You had that vision of daddy because why not? But, mm -hmm. but your banks, something triggers. The Blood War, the Dawn War. You were created for warfare and you were good at it. <gasps> and the Abyss and the forces of the Abyss. You know how devastating they have been in the past. Ooh. You've seen it. And you've answered in kind. I, I'll give uh, give Uthor a, a knowing nod. If he's, if he's battled these kinds, these, these 
creatures. Yeah, uh, murlocs. They're nothing. They're not to be fucked with exactly. They're not the worst of the. They're not the worst the abyss has to offer, but on this material plane, they're dicks. So the fact that they were amassing like orcas and giant crab, bitch, got you. They um, <laughs> tired of these gnats. <laughs> but that's what Uthor did. Uthor and uh, <laughs> Roger, Bert, <laughs> oh, and of course Titus, they squashed out the murloc threat. And it sounded pretty cool. He made it. He's a good storyteller. It, I assure you. It sounded like. <laughs> I know. Yes. I. Yeah. I do know that. They. They do exist Listen, in both. I assure you. you wouldn't have said it I sounded. Oh. Fine. Fine. Here, let me roll something for him, though. I. I, I, I say he's. I say he's a good storyteller, but is he? I believe him to be. Do you believe him to be? Should I roll? Do you want dice to prove it? I'm for curiosity's sake for me. But... Yeah, nice. <laughs> how he does. I also like numbers. Let's do it. Oh. He doesn't have a proficiency in it. That's fine. He's going to do... Um, here's my check then. Book. It's a good story. He describes the crushing lightning that sunder them, the domination of their own very mounts with the trident that he had just received upon his promotion as captain of the guard, as Imperator. He's been Imperator for almost a decade, as it would seem. And it was a post well chosen as he led this small handful. Well, there's hardly anything small about these individuals, but he led this minimal number of giants to sound victory against scores of murlocs tore them apart dominated their own orcas and giant crabs and else they have the giant octopus <laughs> to rip them asunder cool. that's cool Morgan Peace. Tell me more about your attention with my son, daughter, boots. <laughs> oh, too many memes. I was just asking for <laughs> that was for later. <laughs> what are your intentions with my son, the gingerbread man with the frosting? <laughs> they just hold up a picture of a glazed donut. Same page. So, um, <laughs> actually, what are your intentions I'm... with my son? Asked the galaxy. Actually, I like the one. Ah. Um, what are your intentions with my son? And it's it's from um, Animal Crossing, the little where you're supposed to dig, and then after you've dug. <laughs> <laughs> the accent. <laughs> um, I just wanted to know if she had the boots down for later purposes when we we're you know free and shopping tonight. I was gonna spend the time after eating working on my poisoner's kit practicing since okay. i can't do that in the light yeah uh i'm pretty sure that if there's any detail that y'all were going to focus on <laughs> it's her it's her whole slaying steppies <laughs> and the wings of course her well, dramatic yes. mu dramatic queen ass wings Listen, i mean yeah the whole thing the whole Wait. i like the whole Wings. I like it all. Right. I don't... Yeah. Wings. This is at advantage. I've had wings. After he regales you with this story, Brandy. Yes, there have been many threats that have been combated in my long and proud career. The cult of the dragon was no le- Wait a second. Hey, can I see that sketchbook again? 
Uh oh. Certainly. <laughs> it's small. That is. Should, it's like. Sh 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 should I have rolled wisdom? This 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 individual here. This this dark lady with the uh, the uh, what what did you call it? The uh, gothic uh, look. I think yes, it, with it, the it, lovely boots. Yes. 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 I did say everything else about her sucks. These wings look, they appear to be draconic in nature. Or are they infernal? We're told draconic. Dark lady. Draconic. Hmm. In our time in dealing with the cult of the dragon, we spent time above land on this earth coast, and this does remind me of something that I had heard of a dark lady. A Nervurin. You saw Nervurin personally. I draw what I see. How did you come to meet this one? And how did you walk away? Forgive me if I'm... We were in public. Um, we didn't know who she was. We had a conversation. A, a conversation? With... With one of the oldest dragons I have ever encountered. And a shadow filled dragon. No, no less. What uh, was the nature of this conversation? Forgive me my insistence, but this. I must know. You have, you have been swimming in cults and associated with the, the cult of the dragon itself, but Nervering is something else entirely. That's part of the problem is we were, like I said, we were trying to take out these cults who were creating, you know, these, these weapons and, um... <clears throat> We ran into a lot of different people this... in a short period of time who had interest. But, you know, we're mostly just trying to do the right thing and stay out of, you know, and not become <laughs> used by any of these forces. Parties with interest in these weapons, these weapons, these ones that destroyed the <laughs> city. Nervurin was one of yeah. these parties. Not, not just. Once again, I look at Morgden. Um, I'm looking at my notes. Sorry. Yeah. It, anyone else want to? It, it has with been a long time. I apologize. I'm trying to remember the exact conversation. I remember having it. We were in a tavern, and or we were in. An... Not. I think I believe no. you were. No, I know what Nervurin. We went to her house. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. In the sorry. tavern of Zarya. I'm thinking of the bronze yeah, dragon. Yeah. That's why I'm confused. Okay, my, my She was a homie. Yeah. She, she's a bit sassy, but she was a homie. All in all. Uh, Zarya and Felgolos. Or baby Felgolos. Jeez. <laughs> he, he just lives as a cat now. He's like, I'm done. I'm done dragoning. Fuck this. <laughs> I think... What were we talking to her about? I, I don't have notes on her. I remember Here. how we got away. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, we, 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 we bribed her with, <laughs> with... Yeah, I remember how we got away. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, This is above table. We didn't just say we bribed yeah. her with things. Yeah. <laughs> no, of course not. 
I'll, I'll let you word this as carefully or as bl bluntly as you wish. Let me... When you know the answer. Oh, shit, it's Ethan. Mondo, if you must, we will bid you adieu, and uh, we'll switch to the five camera scene. I can I can hang on for a few minutes if you want to finish this scene first. Okay. After that, Nancy, we gotta talk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes you you recall I can help you if you like uh, there's a Spe speaking of Tomovar. bribery yeah the complexity <laughs> of this plan convince Nervarim to give us the weapons Thaddeus Oberon the righteous <laughs> buy something from my throne and I'll tell you what you're missing <laughs> <laughs> dude it's fucked up Oh, Moo Mu is Pretty casting cool. sending to Lady Nervarim. Not sure if you remember that. No, I remember that. No, that was like well that. after the fact. Yeah, I remember that for sure. But um, yeah, that was. I that wasn't was... here for this session, but it makes a lot of sense that Mew was involved. Must stop the orb. You you want to know who was primarily involved? Morgan knows. Dane. Yeah. Dane? I kind of had a feeling. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Roll a history check. Everyone, everyone, be okay. be good little D and D players. Yes. For Daddy DM, Daddy. and roll me a lovely history check. That is oh, look at you, settle down. Twenty five. Okay, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck me in I half. Know stuff. Okay, I'm so, fine. so you went to. <laughs> oh my God. So you went. You remember in in vivid. Detail, you're like, those boots? I remember that day. <laughs> Goes back to this, this lovely vista of birds chirping, birds shining, sun chirping. <laughs> I remember that. Exactly it was, it was weird. It, of course you remember that. It was bizarre. You'd... You wouldn't forget a day like that. You'd never heard a song like that from the sun before. Usually it sounds more like a mockingbird, but this time it was like a whippoorwill. It's must been the weather. The anyway, minor magic you're... of the day, but then it's centered on like these boots. <laughs> yeah, but yes, it was. <laughs> it was a lovely, mysterious forest, a, a a haunting palace, the kind of place that you would definitely urbex and take some pictures. This broken down manor. We fell through the floor. You fell through the floor. You landed in mm -hmm. the fucking dining room. And she's like, the fuck? <laughs> You're like, oh, Sorry, shit. We were there to like... You're there to find out more. Around. You you had heard from... But we were trying to be sneaky, and then we fell through the floor. You fell right? through the floor as sneakily as we... possible. Well, I mean, we were going in to like do a little recon before we had any conversation or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it didn't work out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, fate conspired against you. Um, hi, it's me. Anyway. I'm fate. Uh, but I fate. <laughs> yeah, the floor, was, the floor was crumbling and, and perhaps even rigged. I mean, she knows what she's doing. We fell through the floor, <laughs> landing in what used to be a lovely appointed, lovelyly appointed <laughs> dining room. Now, with lots of clutter and bullshit and deep dark shadows in the back of the room, from which emerged the dark lady being like, The fuck? Excuse me. <laughs> you're like, Oh shit, hi. Um, yeah, we're wondering about the, uh, the call because you were informed by, by a harper in town. I believe it was Tobovar who was approached by a harper to be like, Hey, we, um, we saw some shit going down at, uh, <laughs> at Rudroth Manor. Rudhureth Manor. Uh, we saw some of this cultists you've been talking about. Like, going in and then leaving in a hurry. So, uh, we kind of think they're doing some shit there. So you asked about that. You're like, so about these cultists? And she was like, <laughs> those cultists. Some of them were delicious. They wanted something yeah. from me, and, um, well, they paid dearly for it. What do you one from me, little ones. So you kind of got your answer. What you wanted from her was, what were the cultists doing there? Trying to garner her favor and failing. 
much like Dane, who granted her for passage out safely without being eaten. Two of your precious elemental weapons. She, she sweetened the deal to give Dane the black dragon sword, the slumbering dragon sword, so that you could maybe do business in the future. There are more of these where this came from. Yes, I would like to have those as well. Here's this for you, for such a noble sacrifice. Here's a cool sword that levels up with you. And maybe doesn't have as bad of a curse as Iron Fang does. And Dane's like, great! I'll grab my stuff. Squad we're, off. we're off. And off he I, went. I really feel like I was missing that session. Because I remember hearing the story of this, but I don't remember yeah. being there for it. So it makes so much sense to me. If I wasn't, that I remember the red dragon and the bronze dragon so much better than I remember that one. I'm just saying, sorry, it was driving me crazy. I trust you were there for a Klogili Matar as well. The green dragon. Yeah, we talked to... We, we ta talked yeah. to Kogli. Yeah, good luck. Kogli it's 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 a tough one. I have done my best to practice. Klia Matar. <laughs> it's my job. I'm a voice actor and a DM. I must. But thou must. Klogili Matar. It's a tough one. Anyway, I mean, yeah, thank you for that. Our, yeah. Of course. He's probably been watching us and laughing. Yeah, you, you rolled the fucking tits right. off of that history check, so yeah. <laughs> least I can do. Okay. Very least I can well, do. Typically remembering something. shit's gonna be a fairly low DC. But yeah, so that, that deserved a bit of a recap. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, sorry, go on. In a book table, Should I was I? trying to barter us out of there with one of what? them. And Dane was like, yes, how about yes. we take two? And just... Yes, yes, Morgden, you're blameless. We get it. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. <laughs> no, I'm only half to blame. <laughs> yeah. You're 50% blameless. Should, should, I, should I take this? No. Do you want me to... Dane is, is always deserving okay. of <laughs> just Ulthar, all the shade. Ulthar, we had yes. a larger party at one time. And <laughs> included... A, a charismatic but not very smart man. We love him dearly. Um, it, my condolences. Managed to keep... it, he is no longer with you. Yeah. Oh, maybe he's having a oh. great time with his wife. But oh, he he's, lives. He's Here's actually traveling with oh. his ex-wife. I yeah. made assumptions. Uh, discussing Novarim <laughs> when you say you used to have a larger party, I immediately assumed Yes. Um, well, thank you. Thank, thanks for your condolences it's not needed he's still alive somewhere probably due to his char charisma and that is how we got out of that situation Ulthar. let me tell you <laughs> this guy talked circles around Norvering. you think you'd think that we all should be eaten right at this i moment. would yes uh, it, or far worse uh, corrupted but this turned into but this a, man shadow beasts or some such when I this see what man. she's doing, I help her with all this description on what Dane did. Oh, no, 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 not not too many details. Just <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Let me, no, let me like absolutely I, let me know what you say. I mean, no, that's like I said. Why, <laughs> when I realized what she's doing, where uh, she's not being a hundred percent with the facts. Uh, if you, no. they okay. don't have okay if, bosses, but we can throw Dane under the cart. Uh -huh. Yeah, oh, absolutely. Yeah. That's if, what we're doing. Morgan, if you <laughs> want to back her play. Yeah. Again, you have two choices. You can either tell me exactly what you say, or you can use the help action. I'm just going to use the help action because I'm, what I'm thinking in my head is I'm, I'm more like, um, it's like wingmanning it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> 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 So it's yeah. a survival role, right? Well, <laughs> Michael P as a wingman. You fucking wish. You have you have two choices. <laughs> you can either roll you, Brandy. Actually, no. You have more than two choices. Keep going. Okay. That's the one I would like. So, this this man talks circles around the dragon. We didn't even know she was a dragon until she revealed that she was and 
how did this man know she was fooling us the entire time? That is how charismatic this man is. Now, we should have all been. We should all be dead. But, uh, I don't know if you've ever heard the term silver tongue before. This man had platinum tongue. Through us for a loop. I'm how did his, we were looking at each other? How we together left. nervously. He's just. We were, <laughs> we were. We were. We were holding our breath, expecting to get a, a, a fiery breath from behind. But we walked away, thanks to this legend of a man. Is that your final story? I don't know how to do better than that without like spilling the fucking beans. <laughs> I'm just really hoping you do. But okay. <laughs> oh. Fine, Nancy. You're good at what you do. Mm -hmm. So, you can either make for me a deception check or a performance okay. check. Performance, and can I have Morgan help? Morgan's help. Okay. The choice was made to make it the help action. That's pretty good. Shit. That's far less good. <laughs> so the pretty good is going to demand a roll in return. Okay. We're not gonna just we're not gonna just let this pass because he is. <laughs> there is a healthy skepticism. About your ability she to just lick your way out of conversation with never Yeah. She just I'm gonna, licked the words out of her mouth. I'm gonna <laughs> do my thing as well, by the way. Take two, uh. Call me in the morning. Sorcery points Let me away and uh, add a d4. Okay. Add uh, to me? Yeah. Okay. Here's the d4. Oh, you're doing it? Okay. How in the screaming piss does he not. 21. Have an insight proficiency. Mm -hmm. His perception fine. is he massive. He doesn't need insight. I can change the, I can change the topic over to Harshnag again if we're if we're really worried. Fucking prove it, bitch. All right, here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's hefty That's balls, good. right? That's 21. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, girl. You could see his religion through his leather pants. <laughs> That's right. This is one of my favorite expressions. Not religion, is ser not religion, but you can tell his fortune. You can, <laughs> <laughs> you can read his fucking fortune. Because I... That's how I used to describe my old cosplays, because I uh, <clears throat> went without a dancer's belt for a little too long. <sighs> fuck! Come on! Fuck! Come on! How dare you? I would love to apologize to you, but I'm not sorry at all. How very uh, dare. There must be a way down. <laughs> mm -mm, to what? To what? To what? <laughs> to my, my, to what? My, 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 I already used my reaction, so there's nothing I can do. Did. Yes, he certainly <laughs> did. So, he looks to you and says, That is a fantastic story, and uh, it would do you well were this silver-tongued individual still here, because... That is Let's an, put my hand on that is an aggravated fallacy, and I will not accept that sort of argument in this court. <laughs> 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 Would that this platinum tongued individual were still here, as he might she ate him. be? <laughs> how did you? How did you get out of this situation? She what? ate him. She knew he was lying to her, ate him, and sent us off on our merry way. Yeah, I'm not back in this one. <laughs> I can't help but keep referencing the natural 20, and I just... <laughs> I, I'm but one man here, you see. I, I, there's, I feel like my hands are tied. Motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the truth? I would very much enjoy the truth. It is not that I do not trust. We appealed your to her intentions. draconic nature, and we gave her a very expensive magical item. If I may in exchange ask, for our freedom, 
I do understand this, that usually that would work on dragons of a chromatic nature typically, and even of a metallic nature. We know deeply of dragons. But Novarim is a dragon from the Shadowfell. A deep, dark plane beyond the reckoning of our natural laws. It was a cursed pick that our friend Dane had been using as a... I, I'm blanking. Joe's blanking on the name of the... What you call... Pack weapon. The, the pack weapon. As a pack weapon. Wild bullshit. Was very cursed. <laughs> yes. It's yes, called it's... Iron Fang. Iron Fang. As it turns out, it's very powerful when it's used in utilization with the three others uh, that are similar to it, but... He doesn't have all four. Four weapons of yes. the elemental cults. Mm -hmm. I understand. Nervrim is indeed one of these interested parties. You gave Nervrim one of the elemental weapons. Save our lives. The devastation orbs of which you spoke. I it's either that. I understand. You or she kill us and take it anyway. You live. I understand this. I do not necessarily blame you. You had to make I mean, a difficult one of us. choice. But the fact remains. And this is a fact of which I must be kept abreast. You gave her one. She will seek the others if they are so important in concert. If the four cults you spoke of, opposing elements, Sarissa has been very excited in her magical studies and has spoken at great lengths of the manipulation of the weave, the concert between the planes. The, the opposition of the elements is also something that is true to our storm giant blood. We are creatures of water and lightning. We are water and air made manifest. Turbulent souls that are more powerful because of our depth of our make of an elemental bend. Oppositional elemental cultists working together towards a common goal can be nothing short of cataclysmic. And now Nervering has a vested interest in this. Am I Correct. All we have to do is get it back for la later. Or we'll kill her and get it back. <laughs> it's more likely we'll trick her, but... <laughs> Listen. You performed as admirably as you can. <laughs> Listen. As admirably. You performed God, as you performed as admirals. You performed as admirably as you could against. Put on my tricorn hat. Oh fuck! He took it, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, Brandon took his. Mm. <laughs> and yet you were in fact felt by her elements. We did mercifully have the benefit of not being as uh, vulnerable to her elemental breath as creatures of. Warriors! Lightning. But... Nervarim is far older than Yenrith. I would not take her lightly. I would not take her at all. But... You have met with her. You have treated with her for your survival. And she accepted she has plans for you. This much is clear to me. What they are, 
you can only dread, but she has plans for you. As I believe uh, the late queen had used an expression borrowed from some of these small folk with whom she spoke. Watch your ass. <laughs> oh, you like it? <laughs> Is that it shined? Oh. <laughs> Honestly, it feels like that's all we ever do anymore. <laughs> Yes, it is very nice. One way or the other. I'm gonna say we've made <coughs> many. We've made. We've had to make a lot of rough decisions, but all we want to do is do what's right and help out where we can to keep this from escalating. He will he'll all we're pull out a a, um, a tit. No, he will pull out. <laughs> You pull, you pull out, <laughs> booby. Who's the tag? Book. Like it? No. You will pull out a, uh, a. Might be under the sea. It. Fuck. Hmm. <laughs> it. It looks like a gourd, but it has. The, <laughs> <laughs> well, answer. <laughs> Fucking make me. <laughs> oh, no, I'm, the responsibility for this clip is in your capable hands. <laughs> God damn it. He pulls out an object that, uh, that is... He doesn't do anything. Nothing happens, and you all leave immediately. You are banished from Maelstrom, never to return. Hey, we're oh, friends no. of Maelstrom. <laughs> now you're just somebody that it used to know. No, oh, he pulls out, a, pulls out an object. It's it's not dissimilar to... No, no. No. <laughs> it's a flask, all right? It's a fucking flask. He pulls out a flask that is shaped like a gourd, but it has the texture of a mollusk shell. All right? We And a baltus. Can we... Can my precious sluts just let me breathe for a minute? <laughs> my God. Hey, look, he has a flask, I can, too. I can only... I can't believe you're making me blush. You're making no, me Nancy blush. Nancy has a flask. <laughs> okay. I mean, Brandy has a flask. Okay, you meant the actual <laughs> flask. All right, Jesus. Fuck. Right. This is the first time you've seen, like, a... Well, not the... This is the first time you've seen a fearful, anxious crack in oh. Uthor's veneer. Oh. Crack. Sorry. I swear to God. <laughs> I started that sent. I, start, I started that description with fearful and anxious. I don't know where you wanted that to go, <laughs> it's, it's okay. but I guess I better learn. <laughs> if you're at a loss for words, just say listen. Listen. <laughs> I'm. I'm a fan of look. It buys you a few seconds to think. It does. It really does. <laughs> All right. Look. <laughs> listen. <laughs> he takes We're a listening. swing. <laughs> yes, you are. No, I bet he does. Yeah, you know what that's going to look like, the, the brandy. <laughs> it's been a great session, everyone. It's, uh... <laughs> I'm about to retire from Dungeons in, and Dragons. In Brandy's stack, where she keeps all of her <laughs> attachments, there's a little vibration. I can't believe, I, of all people, you're... <laughs> <laughs> Whipping out gourd cocks. It's not me. <laughs> I can't help it, okay? Sometimes you just get the urge to it's suck a on a. Recipient. Suck the cream out of the. Uh huh. Come on. Hey. Hey. Hello, please. I'm having a moment. Eh. Hey. He demonstrably takes a pull. Shit. 
<laughs> the conversation ends with him drinking an alcoholic beverage from his container <laughs> that he has <laughs> brandished. <laughs> I can help myself on that one. I need to give in. <laughs> You drive me to drink. Damn those Dover boys. <laughs> Fucking cheers. <laughs> anyway, game. What are we doing? We're playing game. This is fucking good, by the way. Like, yeah, surprisingly good. The, <laughs> the shitty rum and the pumpkin spice. Basic <laughs> bitch ass. I'm telling you, it's pumpkin spice season still. Until I say otherwise. I am the Emperor of Halloween. Thank you very much. So. He takes that swig. And I completely forget where I'm going with this. I'm gonna, oh. I'm gonna mute my man over here because he's having a nice little snore. <laughs> um, so, loves, you're in good company. <laughs> you are not alone. You're not alone. You are not alone. I don't feel alone. He's asleep for you. <laughs> <laughs> if she seeks the element void, it would behoove you to seek the other three before she does. Great. I would not. If they are as powerful as you say, you said that the devastation orbs can destroy an entire town, and the weapons themselves were wielded by the. the the prophets, the leaders. You have killed three of them. You have two in your possession. Two. Yeah. What? We still have two? Don't do think we you? have any right now. Do you? I don't know. Do you? I don't have one. I don't have one. <laughs> I don't. More than yes, you do. Wait, I do? Yeah. Yes, you do. You have the dagger from, uh... You haven't identified that yet, so, you know, if you have time to kill, which you do, maybe do that. Oh, that's right. That's what I was going to do last week, wasn't it? At the end of the session. Yes. So you get, you're you going to have time to kill while you're burning the midnight oil, which I think is literally what the candle is called. Yeah. yeah. But I would do that before then, because... The, it will give you at your some point it was. back, I guess. Well, no, it's a ritual. It's a ritual. You have that. Like it might be, be a stickler about that fucking 100 GB pearl. You've been to water deep. You have the pearl. Fuck it. If you didn't <laughs> specifically tell me that you bought a 100 GB pearl, just do me a favor and take away 100 GB. Because I've been letting you get away with Identify for a long time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, let me look. I actually, no, I didn't get any pearls. Because it only wants. Pearls it, it, it doesn't. Right? It doesn't. Uh, well. It actually. Eat it. You are. It does need it. It doesn't consume it. Oh, it does? It does need it. I mean, it doesn't eat it. it does, if that's what you said. Oh. It doesn't consume it. That's... You just need it as a component. If there's a component with a cost, then that cost matters. That my but revivify costs. That eats it, yes. That consumes the diamond. I, if it says which the spell you? consumes, then it will consume that. You're just going to have to spend Since that Since my plan was originally to do that, like, beginning of session... Can I have, at some point, asked if they have any expensive pearls here I could buy? That's a very good thing to ask of an undersea giant fortress, of which you are currently friends. So, I really was just going to say, just take away your 100 GP and you could have had it this whole time, because I'm not a fan of having to do all that redaction. So you can just do that. Here. But... Honestly, I would say do that because it. Yeah, I'll you, do you, that because you've be done identified before. a number of times before, and that would be the only way it would work. All right. Yeah, yeah it, I, I'm a stickler gold. for things with the cost. I mean, I I give you a lot of concession, like Dane with his fucking crystal Dane. I was like, all right, fine, put some creativity towards it. I'll save you the cost. You have a bunch of gems. 
Make it one big jam with your weird bullshit magic. And here we go. Now you have a... Now you have crystal self-cessed. Motherfucker, you know so he's doing that. Ten flat. Okay, so... Okay, now I really do need to run. Okay. Mondo, we miss you. I will. We will, we will wrap Talk up to you all later. the session in the five the five camera scene. But yes, thank uh, you for sticking around for the lecture yeah. so you could be part of the gourd whipping out conversation. Yeah. The gourd process. I'm sure you're <laughs> thrilled. I have, that, I have that sort of setup to clip. There's probably a few that are going to not have names that you can get rid of, but I'll, I'll tailor it. You know me. I clip a good clip. See you all later. A clip of streams gone by. Enjoy. And now we say farewell to Mondo. Two five. Five cam. Cameras, please. Cameras, please. And I did that little bit of retconning. To be fair, like in the first bunch of times we went to town, I did. I was like, um, I go and buy, you know, components from a pouch, and then you just had me take some silver and stuff out. So I would have done it then. Go first. Yeah. Yeah. When I do it. <laughs> Morning. Bulbous. Bulbous. Lovely. Terse. <laughs> Rigid. Rigid. Turgid. Yeah, turgid. <laughs> now, now I'm just going. Now I'm just going through. Um. Ten things I hate about you. Because the scene changed, right? I went to the five scene. Thank you, Jopas. Thank you so much. Uh, so you just. Oh, you heard was a series of descriptors of some mysterious <laughs> element. It's a penis. Great. It's um, not, but, you know, wishful thinking, I guess. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievably, this time it's not. From me, First it's time not for everything. supposed to be a penis. But, you know, it's just... One can't help it. But yeah, McCall, yeah, you're right. I shouldn't like, be I, muted. I can't believe that y'all made me blush. <laughs> That's some bullshit. Chopa said I'm muted? No, no, no. Oh, okay. That you were the ones that... Oh, okay. I could hear a ridiculous laugh. Got it. No, 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 Chopa, he is Joe. <laughs> hey. Hey. Hi. What's up? Hi. Having a good time? Yeah, it does help. Thank, thank you so much for calling. That does help. I adore being called cute. So, uh... <laughs> I'll never knock it off. No, no, Nancy. Nancy. Never. Shidani. Never. I mean, rather, Brandy. Shidani. It's me. Hello. Yes. And a relevant to kill to guess. What, um... <laughs> just pass the fuck out of the middle of the throne room. Pass just, the just, no. just flips. I took her I took her to That's right, you took her downstairs and you came back up. You're like, hey. You just flopped her ass over the crates <laughs> and kissed those the fuck goodbye. Yeah, they're gone. Oh, yeah. Gonna <laughs> huh. need another Timmy. God, this was so good. Um, what you doing now? 
What do you do with his Urgent heavy? <laughs> yeah. What do you... <laughs> what do you do? What do you do with the the heavy thing that he has presented to you? Uh, my best. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> have I? Good girl. Do I know that I have that since I identified it earlier? You know what's really magical? Your sword, your the... dagger. Yeah. Do you know that you have the what? I know it's the dagger. I am, but. <laughs> Because that went above my head when, we, when I grabbed it. Yeah, it would. We're not talking about the same thing. <laughs> Damn it. Where is it? Come here. No, this one? I copied it and pasted it. Where'd it go? Ah, this one. Do I do. I, I know I have to sleep to change my... Get to rearrange my spells. Get, my get spells your spells rearranged. rearranged. Yeah. <laughs> get all up in them spells. Uh, right, in, right in front of uh, Uthor. Just get Uthor to help you rearrange the shit out of your spells. <laughs> you, you did show him how nicely polished you are. Bring that gourd with you. <laughs> what you are aware of is that Sarissa is going through Rolodex, making some calls. They called Cloud Giant. Count Ball. Count a clear giant to uh, to discuss the search radius of now a blessed 29 miles of the trackless sea. Ooh. If, uh, if Morgan's buying uh, focuses, my it's crying already needs a focus. It's done? Oh, okay. That is already so, done, so in this case, now that it's come up, you're yes. going to need to ask around a little bit. What do you need? Uh, oh, I, I need a focus here. A one of one of four things. A focus worth at least a thousand GP, Ooh. which could be the sword that I picked up, or crystal ball, or a silver mirror, or a font filled with holy water. Which is why I asked about uh -huh. Sarissa's meditation pool. Mm. If I could use cave. her holy water, it's a cave. It is a cave. cave. It's, it's not okay. That. A focus uh, worth a thousand GP. Could I focus on the rapier that I picked up that's worth 2500 Or does it have to be like a holy symbol? What kind of cleric are you again? A warcaster? Oh! War domain? Yeah. yeah. Focus on a sword? Hell yeah! All right. <laughs> I don't need to fucking shop. I got it. It's loot. Fits with me. It is. I mean, especially because you're. It's over double the cost. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll let that. I'll let that happen. Certainly. It is on brand. Like you, especially with this recollection of. You don't necessarily remember. You remember the sensations. You remember abyssal flesh. It is. It was repugnant. It was crushing under my mace and in your hands. You remember, you recall your dream. Yes. That one, that one dream of walking through blackness. Yes. That blackness starts to dissipate. The clutter that you stepped upon in that dream. This is you know, a little bit of retconning. Because this is what happened when the discussion of the abyss occurred. But specifically, that instance. It was essentially the Terminator. The Terminator 2 and the, <laughs> the Terminator 1. Skulls? Yeah, the, the stepping on. Yeah. The mechanical foot just. It was that. Except there was it was more intimate because you reached down. To grab. Squeeze. Come with me if you want to come. Live with me if you want to come. <laughs> Live with me if you want to come. <laughs> it's my favorite. You just like coming <laughs> over a and over. Moment. Listen. <laughs> Listen. Unbelievable, you. <laughs> You want to know what's behind the darkness? 
Who doesn't? Nancy, I know you're muted because you're a good girl, but... Yes. <laughs> Do you want to know what's behind the darkness? Yes. Red. <gasps> Red. Undulating. Multitudinous shades of foreboding. Consuming. Pulsing. Red. It would be... It would be insulting to call it a field of flesh. It is more like the manifestation of a concept. It is It is a land upon which you walk that is not a land. It is death as it lives. It is not the lack of life. It is the eternal theft. You have seen things. This is a moment in which Maybe it was a mercy that you did not remember. But with what you've done, with what you've consumed, with what you've pursued, with what you've discussed, all of these things in concert with each other, as the dick jokes come to a head and conclude and are in their refractory period, you... Consider your spells. You consider your focus. You... We're going to say that you have gone to the guest room, in this case, if no one is doing anything specific. Correct. Good. You've gone to the guest room. You are fucking around with a candle. Mm -hmm. Joe, what do you think the candle smells like? Oh, the midnight oil can? Yeah. All right. Uh, let me look at the thing real quick. Because I had that somewhere. Because you know how much I, I just, how much of an olfactor feel yuck I am. I'm like, tell me, yes. let's talk about what it smells like. Because there's nothing quite as visceral to setting a Dokes. scene. It's talking about the smell. To simply smell like I'm... mineral tells you so much more than hearing it drip off the moist Funny tables, cause... right? Mm, dripping. So it's oil that burns in a lantern, so. Ah, right. It's put not it a in a lantern. So it's like a yeah. I, I misspoke earlier, but it will have a scent because of what so. goes into it. Smells like Red Bull. Where is it? Where is it? Smells it? like Jaeger. <laughs> Goldschlager. Fucking root beer. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> man smells. It's leather and cigars and other disgusting yeah. shit that I would love to purge out of my fucking furniture. Oh God! You smell like a no. You smell boy smell is where it's at. Man smells. Fuck that. So it try hard. Cinnamon. A uh -huh. flask of oil and Pixie's parasol. And Pixie's parasol is. It was the little pink. Pink. Little stuff. mushroom duders. Yeah, little, little pink mushroom duders that. <laughs> duders. Ah. Uh, sounds like a jobicism immediately right off the bat. <laughs> it's, it's. Um. Hmm. It it grows so at dawn. It's nourished by the sunlight at dawn, and it grows out of a piece of wood. Hmm. So I would say it kind of has that in my eye. In your nose. It grows from the wood. <laughs> so, so it would kind of have a little bit of that wood scent, mm -hmm. but also since it's a mushroom, just a tiny bit of decay, which makes it sweeter. Oh, fruity. Yeah. Um. Are we gonna say the road? Oh, I was yeah. gonna say, just like a, I was thinking of the wood chip, sort of like a cedar, cedar chips, like yeah. a like a pra playground yeah. or, or like a, a yeah, but with an earthy afternote, like a playground, yeah. like the kind of the and mulch, then the, the mushroom, yeah, and then the sweet fruitiness of the mushroom, yeah, yeah, that does sound invigorating, actually. If there are anything 
Yeah. Like, it's not a heavy smell. It's, if it's it were like a heavy a smell, it wouldn't keep you. It wouldn't keep you awake. Yeah. It would. It would yeah. lull you down. So yeah, it's a light little brisk, woody, fruity, fruity woody. It's it smells. That's me. Like no, I'm not gonna make the joke. Mm. I think one is the joke. Oh. Yeah, she wishes. <laughs> <laughs> The ingredients ah! on that candle are ridiculous because it is. It's like a wood scent and like a flower scent. All right, Giorgio, right, queef. <laughs> so, okay. You're burning the midnight oil, quite literally. Brandy, you consider your focus. You stare into the sword. You think about your squishy friends and the weapon you've been using thus far, the mace. It's still very comfortable. Crushing. The smashing. The destruction. The pulverizing of all that stood before you. The charge of those who led. To their victory and demise. You lived so that many, many, many more would die. You hold this. You hold this. This tribute to vanity. <laughs> you hold this octopus tentacled, bejeweled, utterly opulent and tacky insultingly tacky but yet functional weapon of death in your time now your weapons could be used in such a way to disable to subdue to cripple to damage but maybe maybe not to kill if you so desired but you realize now that just because you've been to the bathroom <laughs> sorry I don't jiggle figures physics engage um you realize now that that was not always the case. Your finely crafted black green strength mace is a beautiful instrument of utter destruction. I this instrument. If used, if not simply shown off, this instrument, if used, is good for nothing but death. It is a repair. There is no, there's no coming back from a strike from this. There's touche and facing mortality. Except right now, except right now, something is different. Make a wisdom saving throw for me, please. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Wisdom save. It's <laughs> this one. Oh. I love it! <laughs> I was really afraid you would roll low. Because I don't want to do mean things to you. But uh, God help me, I will. <laughs> I mean, I kind of am already. In service of this. But you recognize this sensation. As you hold this, you consider the tentacles that form the grip around your hand, your 
metallic, fibrous fingers. They bend so freely, so dexterously, so nimbly, you consider the pressure that you receive as you squeeze the hilt, as you release your grip and your knuckle touches the tentacle. You see the lights that stream through your arm and how the jewels on this rapier, this weapon of death, catch this gentle glow that goes through the lines that intricately detail your hands, your arms, the faceted shine that this weapon, this murder instrument, the facets of the jewel that bring out, that foil your own light. And you think, I was like this once. I will repurpose this. This is now. Used for more than death, as your fingers release and your thumb merely holds the blade, the handle, to your palm. This weapon is now used for more than death. You remember the moment that you fell. You remember the moment that was supposed to be your last. And it wasn't the last of those moments, but it was the first time you were reborn. You fell. You fell in the red fields. You, among many others, fell. But you, instead of many others, were found, reclaimed, repurposed. The first time you opened your eyes, after the fields of red was the first time you saw the cascading black hair the deep soothing voice of Asterion sighing oh Thank goodness. I was afraid it wouldn't work. I was afraid you would have been lost forever. You beautiful thing. But do not worry. You try to move. You cannot. You try to lash out. You try to take his beautiful visage and devastate it. You try to wreak cataclysm upon this gorgeous transcendent being and you cannot you cannot move you cannot act you can only observe as he reaches out and touches your face There, there. There now. It's all right. You are safe now. What you were is behind you.
we have no longer a need for that for which you were tooled. You are so much more than that now. I'll show you. Struggle not. Please, little one. It'll be all right. I'm Asterion. And you are mine now. Your lights pulse. Blood. The faceted gems. In this weapon. This thing that was once good for nothing but death that is now a tool for you to use for far, far more. Joe. Yes. <laughs> Tinder strike. All right. Here you go. <laughs> right here. Say, that's great. Mm-hmm. It's a really good follow up, right? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Tinder Strike sucks. Tinder Strike? <laughs> These elemental weapons are some shit. Is that on? Oh, they're bad? Yeah, well, they're useful, but they no, come at a price. They're amazing. Oh, right. Much like Glorious, they come at a price. Oh, it is in uh, D&D Beyond. Yeah, yeah, it is. But it's also in the chat. You can click on that and drag it into your inventory if you'd like. Because I I believe you added it just as text before. Yeah. Yeah. You identify it. Now you have choices to make. But, yes. Thank fuck. (laughs) Thank fuck you made that wisdom, Dave. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is it going to eat me? You don't know. You don't know. You just remembered a lot of really, really dark shit. So, yeah. so <laughs> yeah. Thank fuck for that natural twenty. Holy jeez. You remembered what you were. You remember the moment of your first deactivation. Maybe not the death blow, the death blow as it were, but you remember the vista like a dream. But this time it's not when you're in shutdown, and this time it's not magically involved. You got triggered through conversation. It's cracking. Your memories are trying to come back. <gasps> cool. All that dreaming you've done. All that wine drinking. Mm, yeah. A wine. The, the shadow bell wine certainly didn't <laughs> did slow it down any. <laughs> that yeah, that was the one. That was the field of darkness. The shadow bell wine was the crushing the. It's a fucking- Oh, yeah. Just so. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> reading the thing. Yeah. With identify, I know everything about it. You Even absolutely the do. You yes. It is not what one would call a cursed weapon. Cursed curses do their best to hide from identify. But no, Tinder Strike knows what the fuck it's doing, and so do you. I put two and two together about the pick. Because I don't think I ever identified that specifically. And Y'all so, definitely I guess had what... uh, an intervention. <laughs> Y'all definitely had the intervention with Dane. Well, yeah, like, we you knew okay, dude? a thing. You, we, you but now like I like weirdly blunder closet on us. So you doing okay? You just like yeah. Now I you just crushed that statue yeah. for no reason. Uh, that was a person. So so now Morgan understands that just a little bit more. Mm-hmm. So I guess what people see is just take a um <laughs> a cheap robe because I don't think I have any cloth out of my bag of holding. Just wrap the stupid dagger up. You are in, it in a guest room. Carefully. There, are, there are blankets. You can just grab one of those. All right, then yeah, I'll wrap it up or in shoot. that. Yeah, pillowcase. And uh, they're human sized. Know, make sure it's tied tight so that it's in there, and slip it into the. <laughs> bag of holding for now uh, and not gonna not gonna fucks with that yours 
Not Mondo's, I trust. Yes. Not Tovar's. Yeah, mine. <laughs> yeah, that'd be a funny uh, prank. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. guess what? <laughs> hey, here's a dagger. <laughs> oh, I love Tobar's daggers. Like, hmm, oh, here's a cool dagger. I think mine. I'll attune to it without checking out. Yes. <laughs> Precious. No, uh... <laughs> I don't know, I was thinking uh, the, the yeah. mine was, was Iron Bang. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is... Yeah, this one... I act without thinking and take risks without weighing the consequences. Well, this is just Dane in a nutshell, anyway. Yeah, that one Dane should have had. <laughs> <laughs> right. Wow, nothing's changed. Right? Yeah, so... I feel great. This dagger's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so, you guys want to go, like, I don't know, have uh, unprotected sex and do some drugs? Uh, but I put it uh, in there. Obviously. Obviously. Why are you asking? <laughs> Why aren't we already doing it? Make so I guess Brandy that we can have return to the <laughs> Oh, God. I would say this entire party should, but Shadani's actually quite level-headed. That's where the name comes from. Oh. I'm holding it together, guys. I it's nominate... just me, but I'm not... Yeah, I nominate Shadani leader. Can I just... Can yeah, I, just say... I think yeah, we've all kind just, of done let's that. Let's throw in the, the hat at Shadani. She, she's the de facto leader. Well, I guess silver oh, hairs. No. Silver hairs the leader. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh well, chap on. The responsibility's here is now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll put that away for now. And I'm because we're doing stuff mm-hmm. is why I'm not bringing it up immediately. <laughs> poison. <laughs> but I will. Yeah, I will bring it up to the group later. Don't worry. Um, so I'm gonna oh, right, work right. on my poisoners kit. Oh wait, no reading. Uh, mm. Reading for the night because I didn't think I could do actual kit work. Mm, I would I would classify that under light work. It's light work. It's work. It's light, but it's work. So I think so. Mm. By the way, okay, you that... got you got some good food. You got some 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 strong food from the kitchen. You got uh, like nice. mussels and scallops and um, a bed of curious rice. It's <laughs> it's not the kind of rice you get from a, a land because you know what happened to that. <laughs> Anarella. Yeah, Anarella ate a lot of like the import <laughs> stuff. She she ate a lot of like the still ate a lot of like pink pink coral bread and fish and all that. But like whatever, whatever land stuff, land grains there were, they're gone. So you have uh, like a curious kind of like I hesitate to say kale because kale sucks, but <laughs> it's yeah. it's like this this vegetal rice. It's it's granular like rice, but it's got this vegetal kind of aftertaste to it. Quinoa. All right, so I have eight hours to that play also sucks to play with. Well, better than quinoa. Let's just eight say hours it's better minus than eleven minutes. <laughs> if you like quinoa, I'm sorry, not for what I said, but for you. <laughs> yeah. But for me. But for you, I'm sorry. I'm I'm sorry. Who hurt so if you? I have, sorry, I have eight hours, so I want to do four hours of poison kit practice. Okay. And then four hours uh, studying the intermediate book, uh, Alchemy for Intermediate Practitioners, because for that one I have 20 hours in towards two recipes, and I have 35 gold worth of credit stored on that stuff. I don't remember how you're... I don't know exactly how that works out for you, but that's what you told me to write down. Yes, I did, didn't I? Okay. Uh... <laughs> oh, shit. There was a system for this, so it's... I. Uh... I, and you know, I could implement this into and the poisoner's kit the module for foundry, but I'm gonna still oh. just do it on the on the sheets for now. Yeah, not sheets. Poisoner's uh, kit. I have 151 out of 200. I do know that? Okay, so and I would do that first. So four hours. Yeah. Four hours. Roll a. Roll an intelligence check for me, please. Intelligence. So um, I don't have to look this up anymore. Never mind. Did you have it in your room? Wait. Come back. Come back, Foundry. The roll, regular roll. There. Roll a Tinder strike for me. <laughs> oh. Okay, well, that sucked. That's initiative. <laughs> That's not correct. Wait. Oh, jeez, I'm smart. You silly bitch. All right, well, what's my... <laughs> I mean, it'd be the same thing. 
mm. plus one. Well, then you're welcome. We're giving you another chance. Okay. Because it was a misclick. So eat shit. Ability check. Take my mercy. That's thank you, fucker. <laughs> thank you. Much better. Oh, I always forget because oh, initiative is on you. up there. All right. Yeah, it's much better. Sixteen. Sixteen. For four hours. Go ahead and add twenty-four to that count. Nice. No. Let's just make it's four hours. It's it's okay. I'll tell you what. You can eat a failure on what you make, and I mean not literally eat. You can take a failure on what you make, and you can add twenty-four. It's not going to be stellar. You're probably going to have to add an asterisk to it if you succeed. And then you would simply yeah, take was, the 16. I'll, I'll take the fail because I was more in it for the practice than okay. anything. Okay, add the 24. Now roll the d100 for me, please. Oh, boy. D100, right, yeah. Okay. 83. Got your lucky fucking stars, my friend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you start to think of what you made for top of our smoke bombs. Try to think about some poison and, and try to think, can I make some sort of some sort of gas? Some sort of, basically, you're trying to make like CS gas. Right? Yeah. You're trying to <laughs> make some sort of incapacitating substance. So, again, mixing some, some noxious stuff together. You know how I do. Shidani. Mm -mm. Yes. Oh. Oh, God. What the fuck is that? Morgan, did you shit? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and Rella did it. What are you doing over there? Shadani, you don't have to do anything. You are immune, I think. I'm pretty are sure I'm immune to poison. poison? And disease. disease, definitely. Um, are you immune to poison? Let me check. Brandy, you're resistant. Killed us all. You fucking killed us all. I am immune to poison. Fabulous. You don't have to do shit. You're just except it sucks. It this is awful. But I mean, you you could be in this all day, and be like. Normally we I could go just draw leave, somewhere but else. Kind of be holding to the candle. Yeah, it's like, what the fuck oh, is that's wrong true. with you? Yeah, so you could, <laughs> you kind of gotta stay. You gotta stay I'm in the resistant. goddamn shit fart skunk room. I'm resistant to. <laughs> There's this, there's this eminence that starts flowing out. You're like, you, you tried to cap it. Like, a big part of the poisoner's kit is the delivery method. So you're trying to make these, these capsules that perhaps Tobovar could just like, flick somewhere, they pop. And you're like, okay, now if I just get it, it's not, it, oh, sh oh shit, it's not sealing. It's God. It's like this foul, <laughs> rank odor. Mercifully, it's not CS gas. That's what the 83 is for. It's not actually incapacitating. It's just vile. It's just, ugh, ugh, ugh. Like when somebody says, man, that's stinky. The word stinky sounds too cute. <laughs> it's, that is rank. That is, that is if, can I, that if, that's if, if rotten eggs had a baby and aborted it. Can I make a mental note to try and remember how to make that? In case I need that specific. No, no, take the 24, you fool. Oh. <laughs> no, you're going to want to do better than this. Fair. I assure yeah. you. Well, I'm just saying, that'd be a hell of a distraction to throw that stink at See, someone. that's the thing. High school pranks. Like I said, big part of the poisoner's yeah. kit is delivery. And you fucked it up. The delivery is what I failed. Mm -hmm. You can You can definitely do it again if you want to try, and that becomes one of your recipes. But... You fucked up. But you learned a lot from it. 
You learned more from it because you fucked up. And it's about time I put the poisoner's kit away. Like, <laughs> but you, however, Lean you're back. ground zero. Make a constitution saving throw, please. And uh, Brandy, please do it at advantage. At advantage because I'm resistant to it. Mm -hmm. Pawn save. Now, mercifully, the DC is relatively low and your um, the, the effects are not going to be... Oh, 17. That's, that's good. 17? 17 good. Yeah, 17, 20. It sucks. It, oh, <laughs> th this just sucks. It just sucks. More you don't death. like this. But you please wash your pussy. I've told you again and again. <laughs> it's important. <laughs> I know Briefly you're new think to about. One. I know you're new to having one, but it's super important. Briefly <laughs> think about sending a mind oh sliver. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Morgan, I guess you have decisions to make. <laughs> Briefly, to <laughs> press to vegetate. <laughs> Y'all think I haven't been trying stuff like that already? Oh my god, of course. Yeah. We, we see the, what I've been thinking about for the level heads chat when I've been writing that script. Press, listen, chat. Press and digitate is basically the ultimate slept upon fuck spell. You could do yeah. so much with press and digitate for that good time. If you can, you can clean something. You know, get those pesky stains out of your sheets. Yeah, easy peasy. We get it. But you I'm can using... also soil something. So you can definitely, as written, press and digitate lube. Yeah, easy. But the ultimate. I'm power also. Move, I gotta share this with the chat. It's so good. You oh, ultimate yeah. power move. Press digitate a small trinket that fits in your hand for one turn. Well, until the end of your next turn. So up to 12 seconds, I might say. I might generously say. Press digitate a collar on someone's neck. Pull it. Bring them somewhere. Throw them down on the bed. Put them to your knees. Whatever. Whereupon it vanishes. Power move. That's that good shit. Or wash more pussy. <laughs> we have options. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> we have options. <laughs> Hold on a second. Need to... <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's so angry. Look at your face. <laughs> I'm literally the cleanest member of this group. <laughs> I'd like to point out, I'm the one that every day cleans <laughs> myself off several times. I don't know. I mean, the smells might say otherwise. It <laughs> seems to be. I take the little thing that I failed putting it in and I wave it over towards it. Like, it's this. Yeah. And as I'm holding it up, I use prestigitation to do a little puff of air that sends more of it towards her. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, Brandy's just. Uh, uh. Then I throw that like way the fuck away from me, and just try to use air puffs of air to get it away from us. I would also uh, remind you that you can create smells. You can create like yeah, and I would also be adding that smells. In. So just a little. Yeah. So so what? What kind? <laughs> I've given you the description of the smell. Uh, so given that, armed with that knowledge. What do you use? What do you... What Febreze, what flavor do you use to try to... <laughs> mitigate this? Mm. A summer's breeze. You fuck... That's awesome. Great. I appreciate this. There, Brandy. You happy? <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy your summer's breeze. Yeah. See, the joke so for people was... in chat is that that's, that's the brand of, of douche. Yeah, see, that's the... <laughs> welcome. Welcome to the stream, everyone. We're, we're here all night. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Tip your streamer. Yeah. Please. But, but for reals. But, like, actually, if you don't mind. Oh, shit, we've been on, like, a black screen with Voyeur this whole time. Probably a good thing. <laughs> um, but I, I would... Where are we the doing? actual smell would be something that's pretty light and... and and goes along with the candle just to try to get the smell of the candle back. 
So it's kind of a, a fruity, like a fruity cedar, fresh, yeah. light. Yeah. So you're gonna add like what? A little heavier on the cedar Peach. than the than the fruity, so that it's not overly Peach covering. Peach sandalwood you know? is what you're adding to the mix. <laughs> yeah. Something like that. That might that might help. That might help. Okay. Good good call. Because if you if you're like I don't know patchouli, and I'm sorry, that's another constitution. Uh, you will never hear me <laughs> using patchouli smell for anything. I should hope not. I hate it. It's not good. People <laughs> on the bus used to use it all the time. Now they just have weed in their pocket. There you go. <laughs> well then, um, so you read, or you're reading rather. Yeah, then I switch to. Um, I'll say yeah, then, the alchemy for intermediate. Yeah. I'll say then because, good choice, good choice in scent to mask that shit. Because yeah. I mean, you guys, you gotta hang around the candle, which means you gotta hang around the stink. It's in the fabric now. <laughs> We're never getting invited back. Thank God we can come of our own volition. Yeah, I know what I said. Mm. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Okay, okay. If you want to spend time to not be distracted at all, yeah, it would probably take you about four to five minutes, half an hour to four, let's say half an hour for the easy math to all right. just, just fully clean the fabrics and like dust the walls. The, the spritzing of the spray that doesn't take long. In an but if you want to like in an eight foot radius, clean it out. Eight foot, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm, That's as far as I can go. I'm looking at the room. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, it's a belt of consideration. I can't see the room. I have a blank screen. I, wait, you do? Oh, wait. Yeah. Wait, am I... Why? Yep. Yep, all blank. Hit a five. Yeah, I don't see your icons. Hit a five for me, please. Oh, oh I see people. People's tokens, at least. Let me click on I just see the <laughs> Be of the mind it is. Like the entire map. What is regard? So the oh, the, the really? odor melted. Well, that sucks. I'll do an F five then. Oh. It takes a second. Hold on. <laughs> but it's okay. The I was one. in the middle of reloading. <laughs> How dare you see the entirety of the beautiful ocean that is there for your very enjoyment? <laughs> I. I'm Thank so you. sorry I saw the ocean, Slappy. Right. You're just going to have to kick me out again. You already did it <laughs> once tonight. All right, peace. Bounce, right. <laughs> homie, go back to saving kids and the trafficked humans and etc. <laughs> Got anything better to do. <laughs> go be a hero or whatever. Oh, literal, <laughs> literal fucking, like, lawful neutral hero to the people. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm actually chaotic neutral, so I don't know. Shit. <laughs> so I do it for kicks, okay? Uh, I don't get any, any enjoyment out of it, I uh, swear. We're tieflings. I swear. Chaotic neutral tieflings, rise up. I take a little bit of enjoyment out of some of the stuff I do. No shit. <laughs> <laughs> I can see the map, I just can't see me. You fucking killer. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, I did not kill anyone on purpose. Listen. Except for those other people. Except for the Except ones for like, this, week, we this week. Except you for those who are no longer with us. This week. They don't count. Except They're for gone. the one per. Except for the. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You're, Nobody you're, who didn't have it coming on purpose. Okay. Yeah. It's my favorite line from Dracula Dead and Loving It when she's talking about putting the heads on a pike and everything. It's like. They had it coming. <laughs> roll for me. Roll over. Just, just roll over. Bro. Are you spending the time to clean the stuff? We can spend half an hour. It's, cause it's gonna kind of diminish your score. But if you don't, yeah, I'll take. Do I'll that. take an hour. I'll take the thirty minutes. Okay. For everyone's sanity. Good girl. Currently. Ariel? Uh. <laughs> oh, well, yes. Um. Thought I heard someone. Right. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
guess. It's not good. Yeah, because she, she never knew. She never knew Morgan as as bearded emo gentleman. <laughs> All she knew was Morgan, the big titty goth adjacent girl who rolled up in the rubber summer and said, I'd like to study. Can you help me study? <laughs> study, 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 study. Study, study. I just <laughs> handed her a number. I don't know what you people are talking about. Or uh, where we're at, not a number. Then we read books all night long. No, no, she got your number as soon as you walked in. Yeah. That too. Oh. You're cataloged. <laughs> anyway, that's a fantastic in interaction. Roll in intelligence. Or, rather, okay, hold up. This is reading from a book. Yes. <clears throat> it's a belch of consideration. Mm -hmm. Wish I could see your... Oh, I can. The carousel does it for me. Hmm. And it's alchemy. Alchemy recipes. You are proficient with alchemy supplies. Mm-hmm. What did I have you do before? So have you make an intelligence check? Because I would actually just rather say roll your alchemy supplies. Let me make sure it's using your right stat. Check my notes. And here. intelligence. Yes. It would be it'd be intelligence. Alchemy. Twenty hours of studying. I don't think it'll be anything but intelligence. This is constitution. Like you're you're doing it like the like the mad scientist candy lab. You're like you're just fucking with it and then tasting everything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, since it's mostly studying, Dr. I think Dreadful. you had me do the intelligence. And Dr. Dreadful, that's what it was. Dr. Dreadful. Yeah. You're not practicing with the, with the kid, it's studying, so it's definitely going to be intelligence. But I would still say go ahead and roll with the alchemist supplies, because you have your reference material. You have your, like, examples. It's like the difference between reading, I don't know, what, what the fuck was it, W3? About coding examples, and then actually coding with it open. Like, it's... Oh. Yeah. One's just reading, one's actually trying at once. So yeah, click that shit. Click that shit. In my bag of holding. It's also under your attributes. If you go to your attributes tab, it's at the bottom, tool proficiencies. You can just click. Oh, okay. You can click that. that helps. Mm -hmm. I'm very helpful. I, I try. Because that... I could not find it in there. Okay. Oof. Straight 10, so 15. Show you a straight 10. Oh! I guess I already did. No. Armed with a mortar and pestle. <laughs> just, just, yeah, you just didn't get a book open, get a mage hand, your book is holding it open, and you're just. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> one moment I look over at Brandy and I hold up the uh, yes. the mortar, I believe it is. And I just wave it. The... And put it, start crushing again. Yeah. I think the mortar's the, I... the sticky thing. No, that's the pest. I thought. Mortar is the anvil, and the pestle is the oh, right, thing yeah. that crushes. Yep, I think. you're right. All right, I show I show her my pestle. Oh, what? I showed you my pestle. That's Please respond. Girl. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, I don't listen for a response. I just wave it and then go back to crushing. You don't listen for it. That's a bitch. <laughs> but there ain't no way you don't hear what Brandy says. Yeah. Brandy is <laughs> anything but subtle. Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. So, with a 15... What's your notes again? <laughs> oh, it's so, the for this, I've done 20 hours of studying mm -hmm. towards two potions. Uh, or two uncommons and uh, two rare. I have 20 hours of studying, and then I paid 135... Uh, gold for the book, and you said I have 35 gold worth of credit towards the studies from the book left. How much gold was used for the recipe so far? 135. Or 100. 100. Sorry. And then 35 in credit. I wish yeah. I really wish I would have made that math easier. Uh, oh, Need. wait. There was a... Sh I was using a reference. I think from the... Yeah. GM binder? Mm-hmm. Because I have the, I have that the link would be to that. Helpful once again, like I should just pin it. We should definitely just pin that fucker. Here, let me, let me go to our cheat. Hmm. 
Because mm-hmm. I was about to just make it up on the spot. I mean, um, definitely do what I always intended on purpose. an intermediate alchemist there we go learning recipes wait really oh i see oh no that doesn't work you can't have 35 left in credit that's weird that's what you told me to put down i i, I could just gaslight my way out of this and say no uh you're crazy uh-uh. It would. It should work, right? Does it work? No, because I working? wrote it down. I wrote it down the second you told me. Yeah, but here's the thing. <laughs> Listen. Listen. <laughs> it doesn't work out somehow. You also... It really doesn't, so that's why I'm doubtful. You also did try to warn Imperator Uthor about Limrith. Right after the dragon attack. Limerith. So mistakes happen, is what I'm saying. Yeah. I don't mean to throw you in the car like that, but I literally do. Um. <laughs> no, I'm just saying you said you didn't say that. I'm saying you did. We're both wrong. I'll take that. I will. I will jump on this bomb. Let's go. <laughs> I will just hold this grenade in my hand and just, we're going together, baby. Let's we ride to Valhalla. So. Well, I guess I mean it would so make sense. So shut that... your mouth. Shut your mouth, because I'm about to give you a lot. All right. Shut your whole mouth. It's. <laughs> it is, the intermediate book, right? You've used a hundred yes. so far. Yeah. And you spent twenty hours. Hmm. I see. No, it turns out I threw the grenade. It's okay. It's because you've only done as number as many hours as you did. Mm-hmm. You didn't complete the book. So you didn't get that, that cost. Bonus. Yes. So ah. I'm gonna need to make a I'm gonna need to make a reference of the, the maximum cap of this. Okay, so an intermediate book. We're going to say that the maximum number of recipes that you can get from this book to practice and master. You've got all common recipes. Yeah. you got, so far, how many uncommon do you have? I have. I definitely want to like. I don't want to like. Stymie all the you common. Bottleneck you one. One uncommon. Did I not get a rare? I thought I had a rare. You do. I trust you do. I trust you would have put a rare in your. Well, I mean, it takes eighty it hours not... to master it or learn it. But that's. Let me look at the book. Hmm. I'm going to say, all together, from this book, you can pull out two rare. It can take a lot of time, but you can pull out two rare. Yeah. And... How many comments was it so far? From this one? Um. So I know one uncommon. And what you had me write down last time mm-hmm. is I'm studying... Two uncommon and two rare. Because I have oh, the well, ones I have. Oh, then there you go. Okay, so... Right, so it's going to be just a matter of time. That's yes. That's why. That's why the cost was stupid. Okay. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yes. So, um, the maximum you can get out of it is, in fact, that. It is that. It is that. 
Uh, it's going to take your time. You have your source material. You have that. So with a 15 and four hours, it's not a whole lot. Three and a half. Right. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Even worse. Yeah, fuck math now. So yeah, I can't wait to have this argument again. Oh, I'm sure. Oh god. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh mark down three and a half more hours and I really, really don't want to do the math on this. So I'm just going to say, turn that gold back up to 50. Just, you have 50 in the bank. I have 50 gold in the bank? Yeah, instead of 35. Just put 15 more gold on there. All right, I'm going to fix the typo, too. <laughs> and I've made a note. This is the maximum you can learn from the intermediate book. Good. Yeah, please. Help me out. Because there's a, there's a crafting system in Foundry. There's a module for a, craft, a crafting system. Hmm. And I spent a lot of time actually adding a lot of fun ingredients into the compendium. You might even be able to see it. If you... Here. If you... Um, I'll, I'll look. I'll look at it. Compendium packs. Ingredients. Uh, hit control space bar, please. Type Index in, loaded successfully. Type in rain blow. Morning. Oh. Welcome. You live. I had you muted because you were snoring. It was a little cute. I was snoring? Yeah, uh, a, little, a little bit. No oh, shit. And just a little. When did I pass out? What the fuck? Uh, the, just <laughs> during, break. during the first break. During the break, rather. Not the first. The only break. Wow, we've really been going at it. For a long time. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for Sorry. hanging with us. Hey. This has been a lot of fun. <laughs> Anarella was eating a guy, so probably napped anyway. Yeah, and you got picked then up. Then was left on top of two crates. Yeah, you just got dumped in the food, food storage closet, so you, you've been busy. <laughs> I don't know. That's not a good idea. Oh, <laughs> Anarella they, wakes up they, surrounded by food. Well, I mean, oh, no. I, mean, I died. Brandy did I'm it. I'm in heaven. So, oh, of course it's not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Have I died? Brandy's Am I in heaven? the new Dane. Oh, I will take that compliment. No blood closets, though. That's all I ask. <laughs> I promise. I already did that once. So I don't have to do it again. Listen. Oh. Sorry, guys. I, I guess I just Listen. passed out. The, the, <laughs> your, the, the promises you can't keep. <laughs> yeah, we know. Yeah, but you said, boy. I'd say there, okay, a little bit of blood closet. Yeah, a little blood closet. As a treat. It's just, just for me. <laughs> There's a rainbow and a rainbow mushroom. There are two of them? Yeah, one's just rain blow, one's rain blow a mushroom. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, hit, um, earth tongue. Earth tongue? Two words. I mean, it'll, it'll all Okay, that's in there. Yeah. Huh? Right? It's got a nice little little icon and everything. I, yeah. I added these all. I added, nice. I added a ton of mushrooms. Actually, no. It wasn't hey, the look, mushrooms. Hey, look. It's parasol. Was it the mushrooms? Mushroom. Mushroom. Oh, it's not these. These aren't the ones I added. The ones I added are elsewhere. But in any case, I added a bunch of fun ingredients and like assigned them really pretty icons and everything. I had fun. It was fucking tedious, but I had fun. <laughs> 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 yeah. I just haven't really figured out how to do the crafting system yet. So, Anarella. Passed out eating. Yeah. She ate um, too much. She, she had a food coma. Okay. You. <laughs> You're in heaven. Yeah. Just woke up. Next thing you knew, you were talking to Sarissa. She smiled patiently at you for a lot of the <laughs> conversation. You um, went back to bringing more information out of Lord Dryland. Mm hmm. <laughs> the hard way. And uh, of course, it became the skeleton within you, like, you know, little. 
Mm -hmm. A little suspended skeleton in you. With the flesh slowly rotting off of it. It's a horrific, gruesome, grisly sight. But it's also kind of cute. <laughs> Just like my dating career. <clears throat> <laughs> you got bored of it. Or exhausted. Whatever the case is. And... Randy was like, oh, okay, Andra, come with me. Where, where are we going? Just don't worry about it. Whoop. What? Uh, I'm really heavy. Why are you doing this? <laughs> she just fucking beef asses her way down. And just says, mm -hmm. you're, you're gonna like it. Don't, don't worry about it. Okay. Because why wouldn't you trust the other green girl? Of course you trust the other green girl. Of course. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And then, just, uh, what was I doing? Oh, <laughs> I remember. So much more pink bread and fish and grains that are gone now, so that the rest of the party had to eat this weird vegetal kale rice or whatever. Hmm. It's probably healthy, or it's just gross. It's hard to say. <laughs> but you, I think you ate through the entire storage closet that we were in before. You are finished yeah. now. You come back to the room. <laughs> The guest room, you're like, oh, there you are, and the room stinks. Because <laughs> Morgan can't wash her pussy properly. That is not what happened. <laughs> no. It, as it was described, um, it smells like rotten eggs had an abortion. No, at this point, it probably smells like you know a summer breeze. Oh no no no, not yet. Oh, this is before. This is retcon. Okay, a little bit. Just, just a little, little slide in there. Slide in the middle of the study. Yeah. It, Who's cooking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, um. Oh, for you? No, still. Still. What's your what's your relationship to poison? To poison? Mm. Uh, I don't want it in me. <laughs> Anarellus. <laughs> no, 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 I mean, same. She's got no particular resistance. Make a constitution saving throw, please. Alright. She's good at those. That much I can trust. How about that? Oh, fuck yeah. Well, let me see. Where'd it go? It's at my <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> the twenties have been <clears throat> tonight. Jeez, yeah, <laughs> right. <laughs> yes. Can wow. Confirm. Yeah. Ooh. Someone sizzling <laughs> up something. <laughs> yeah. Bert was like, <laughs> you're like, <"Hey>, ooh. <laughs> if Annabella can even dry heave, <laughs> Annabella burbles. There's there's a bubble <laughs> and it pops at the surface. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> who's sizzling something? Because there is a sound. There's a there's a weird like sound coming from the corner of the room. <laughs> what I mean? You see who's, a who's cooking? You see a small like. It's about the size of a popper bottle, but like mm -hmm. broken in half. Like you see, like a, a little capsule, capsule corp capsule. <laughs> Bart, you see, just, this little capsule corp capsule, just half completed, and it's just fizzling out this, this faint, like heat waves out of it. Just this, this utter stink. <laughs> what stink lines represent <laughs> the wavering air that comes out of it? There's a little bit of a, a little bit of a, a green brown kind of gas comes. Green brown, what, yellow, what, what's that? Brownello. Did somebody make something too spicy? Can I have it? It. 
was an alchemical mistake. I'll fucking say. <laughs> <laughs> you see more you see Morgan bustling around the room just like casting little sparkle sporches. <laughs> doing, <laughs> doing little sparkles just just for breezing. <laughs> Cleaning some some bunk out of the out of all the sheets so it doesn't linger. <laughs> oh god. It smells like the the whole room because of the midnight oil that's burning in here smells like one, the midnight oil smells like cedar and honeysuckle, but muted. And now <laughs> what she's going, pff, it smells like, um, what did I say? Sandalwood and peaches. Just, yeah. Yeah. Doing her best to mask the, <laughs> the sulfuric abortions. <laughs> oh god that's an incredible album title by the way that's free no it's not it tip. really is a pretty good <laughs> tip chat tip <laughs> 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 if you use these titles I demand royalties credit me on your song about I don't want to know what it's about I don't want to know what it's about <laughs> that's the title but it's not going to reflect it's a metal song it doesn't necessarily it's going to be nightmarish or mundane. Like, embarrassingly mundane. Mm. So if you're like abortions, is a song about driving to McDonald's. Well, if you're like abortions, combines the two types of music, country and western. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, okay. No country, so. country and volcanic. <laughs> God. Blues Brothers joke. So... The midnight oil that's being burned allows one to... I, you know the description. I think you were still awake when it was heard. Which is ironic, but... <laughs> a little bit of dramatic irony. Uh, it allows you to gain the benefits of long rest without having to rest. But you have to be within the light of the candle. So in the center of your guest room, it hits the whole room. I'm not bothering with Boyer. <laughs> it's just a blank screen. Just trust me. It's there. We've all seen Melster before. Don't worry about it. Giants. Mm -hmm. We get it. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you have any tasks that you wish to complete, Shidani is drawing a sequential art portfolio. <laughs> oh, man. you Okay, you did miss... Well, you weren't in the room, so don't worry about that. <laughs> Watch the butt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's clips. I shall. Yeah. It's already clipped. Cool shit happened. Cool shit <laughs> fucking happened. But, I mean, Uther got pretty fucking horny and it was nice. But the Dark Lady was also discussed. So you'll, you'll explore later. Shinani is drawing a, a, a webcomic series based on your exploits. Yeah. <laughs> Morgden is doing some bullshit. Stinky Listen. pussy bullshit. <laughs> that's you know that's a <laughs> lie. <that> fucking <laughs> say me so much every time. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Fuck me in half. <laughs> Trying. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> and Brandy is saying shit like that. No, Brandy is having dramatic revelations while um, turning that two thousand. 500 gold sword into a focus because she's a cool ass wardman cleric. My, my waking up mind can't let go of this. What? Now I can hear Nancy's voice go like, you need to clean behind the flaps and I'm like, listen. <laughs> <laughs> Nancy, make it just saving throw, please. <laughs> <laughs> Just rest assured, Morgan has explored everything that needs to be explored. Oh, I believe this. I oh yeah, you've been you've been you've been rule sixty three for like I'll, months. I'll now. take out an attachment and like do a health class for Morgan. Okay, so. <laughs> uh, By the way, so what? Uh, I mean, a lot of practice with the chest thing. You hmm. I, 
It just came up when you were still in, I think it was Long Saddle? Or somewhere. What? When Dane was still with you. You I... were looking into the effects of wild magic. Mm -hmm. And how one could reverse it. Make an arcana or history check, Morgan. Right. Since you're since you're on this and Brandy has been making pussy comments, <laughs> your mind is like, I've been doing my best with my pussy ever since I got. Wait. <laughs> Nine. Arcana. Because it's a memory, I wasn't asking for a lot. I wanted a five. Like, if you were to fuck up real bad, then <laughs> tough shit. But it's a memory. And a memory. At least two. Okay, I also had a chosy I had to clean up. Life. Hood. Effects like this. Dispel magic. Do nothing. Like Dane's... Sapphire Eye. Dispel magic does nothing. Yes. Remove curse. Might. But you know what most likely will. Effects that have happened because of a magical effect that is no longer around. The effect triggers the transformation, and then the effect is gone. So, dispelling that magic, it's already gone. Too late. But, rejecting the change... That is the purview of greater restoration. Oh. Arm yourself with that knowledge and do what you will. Yes. I wouldn't change Morgan back if she didn't want to. I mean... No, no, I didn't ask you to roll, Nancy. I didn't ask for oh, any okay, roll. Okay. No. We ain't talking about you, girl! Oh, come on! Love it! Ain't talking about love. We're talking about Morgden. We're talking about Morgden's okay. whole situation. <laughs> talking not in about any Morgan hurry to whole. make any yes. big this drastic whole changes. Situation? It's your whole situation. No, I got it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Not right. in any hurry to make any big changes like that. <laughs> I know. Morgden but <laughs> You can't uncrack the egg, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> it's I magic, don't have of the energy can. to make more. <laughs> I don't have the energy to make another avatar. That's Plus, fine. beards are very hard. That's, that's the only reason. Yes, that's it. That's yep. all. Beards are difficult. All I'm or saying... I, go, like, I, don't, I don't have the energy to make another penis. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The same, like, I, I got the one and, like, I don't know what to do with it. I mean, let's uh, be honest, if I want, <laughs> Morgan, if Morgan wants a penis, dick lamentation. it's not that hard to get one. Flea market? <laughs> please, no fleas. <laughs> Adarello, what you thinking? Oh. What you about? Fucking nerd over there who made stinky pussy juice is uh, is reading a book now. What are you up to? There are about four hours left um, in the uh, in the candles light. You don't necessarily know this, but above the table you do, so you can plan accordingly. Uh, in what kind of available elapsed time frame? Four hours. Four hours left. Okay. Uh, Tokovar is of course sleeping, so that way perfect. when we come back, I will. I will say that the exhaustion will be gone. Be like, <gasps> yes! Princess, princess, sleeping, princess, princess. Which, damn, probably should have made that constitution roll for double. Here we go. Nah. Well, it, elf, or half elf, so trance. And charm is the resistance, but not poison. Come to me. Come to me, come to me, come to me, come to me. Sorry, you were saying, Enrella? Uh, that I was gonna try to see if, since people are big, big here, if they have mm. any decently sized forge. 
Okay. Okay. Um. All right. Four hours have passed. Unlike the weak sauce stuff, I I found at the monastery. I do this. Give me a second. I gotta use the bathroom real quick, and I also take the time to think about what she's gonna say. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry again for passing out, guys. No problem. It's fine. It's fine. I did it once. I think I think <laughs> Anarella was in a fantastic place. Well. Oh, I have no fucking no fucking doubt. <laughs> like yeah. moving from crate to crate, just. <sighs> I mean, you can leave her in the in the in the garbage chute, and she'll be <laughs> in heaven as well. I'm gonna run real quick too. I'll be right back. Oh, okay. Faster! Entertain stream. Okay, I guess. Oh, so I guess this is a break, people. Uh, We're on a break. We're we'll we'll be, we'll be right back after these messages. Do you have a stinky pussy? <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather your pussy smell like flowers and uh, other appropriate metaphorical sense? <laughs> <laughs> try, try clean a cunt. The uh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. It's uh, this is when I come back into the <laughs> new from the shadow fell. <laughs> Nancy, I just realized huh? it wasn't Merlux. It? it was marrow. Marrow. It was, it was marrow. Yeah, sorry. As in bone? No, with an E. Oh. M E. It's spelled the almost the same. But yeah, the thing that you were in Swashbucklers, you were the marrow with legs. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. Cool. Marrow are merfolk, but like. Okay, Joe. You ready? No, okay. he's not there. Bitch. He's in the washroom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tell me. For fuck's sake. I want to know what they are. Okay. So, Joe was quite upset. Uh oh. Um, inverted. <laughs> Tilted. Hmm? The rug was shifted beneath Joe when he came to the conclusion that Dryder means or is spider drow. is child spider <laughs> so you know merfolk uh, also merman red dust fucking rust <gasps> i hate that <laughs> same that one's dumb and rude okay <laughs> so merfolk merman mermaid etc Marrow, Murrow, Murrow, Murrow. Mur oh my God! Thanks, I hate it. Okay, so I know, like, can you indeed dry heat? I heard everything. <laughs> <laughs> the tilt continues. You eventually come around to a, a five fifty McTwist. I wasn't the only one that was thrown back by that. I still oh, have no, my no, doubts, uh, but it makes sense. I'm like, Agog, is it really? Aragog, whatever. Is it fucking really just a portmanteau? Yeah, it probably is. It's a guy. It's a guy. Mm -hmm. Gags. Let's be honest. <laughs> I didn't think that much through. Right. Easiest explanation. It, Occam's razor. Yeah. Let Avery talk to you all about that. So, Anarilla. Yeah, I had to learn about Occam's razor after Angela. you know. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the quickest oh, way to ask clean pussy. <laughs> there you go. You just sit you on No. Payback's gonna come one day. And so will I. <laughs> one day. <laughs> and you won't know when. At, at, <laughs> that's hardly payback, now is it? I just got you back. Did you? Oh, I. Didn't notice. 
And really meant to kill the gas. Yes. Princess, princess, princess. You catch her when she's like she's coming out of the kitchen with like pulling the Bluetooth out of her ear. Like, uh, uh, oh, huh? <laughs> Just coming. She emerges from the um, the meditation cave, kind of rubbing the bridge of her nose. It's good. Uh, oh, uh, yes. What? What is it? Um, are, are you all right? You seemed a bit dazed earlier. Yeah, I'm. Um, I'm okay. There was something in the guy, and it was harder to digest. So I would put uh, Brandy put me with more stuff to digest, so that I was really focused on the task. And and oh. okay, so I'm done. And. and and she she looks at your form, which, considering how much you ate, a lot of it's still there. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, oh, that that's fine. Oh, oh, all right. It, just I have to make some more calls. <clears throat> to get mm? some more from the mail. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, what is it you need? Well, then now I got bored, so I was wondering if if you had curious thing. like if 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 you had because I I well, I'm super late on my chores, and I wanted to know if you had like a a furnace and like an anvil and like a, like maybe a whole forge set up, and maybe I could do some stuff. Oh, what are your chores? You some you are a uh, it sounds like you are some kind of smith or tool crafter or mm -hmm, something. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. We, I'm sorry to say we do not have this. You, I'm sorry. Who is who is making you do the chores? Is it the, uh, is it the the blue, the blue girl? Not girl, but still kind of blue. It's my papa. Oh, uh. Someone who's... I'm sorry, I did not mean to misgender. Um, apologies. Well, um... But yeah, so... I, it was... I'm, I'm still not super clear on if I got to do the chores still, because I'm not in the village anymore, but like... Oh, you're talking I was about somebody not... else. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> My apologies. I, I thought you were it's okay. talking about the, the magic one, the, the Morgan. It's okay. With, like, repetition and some discipline, you can end up understanding stuff. This is so good. This is <laughs> fucking adorable. Oh, I don't realize so cute. Anyway. <clears throat> so, 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 yeah, I'm not super not clear on... Who is I would assume... I. Uh, well, I should get to the point about it. it. I don't know if it is a matter of your own discipline. It's important to keep up with training if that is important to you. But uh, we do not have a forge, I'm sorry to say. The weapons mm. that we craft in the the things that, uh, as you may have noticed, the furniture, the tools, the weapons and everything that we have are harvested from the sea, the floor of the ocean where the immense pressures do a lot more of the forging for us than could really be done by many of the small folk smiths. We cook mm. our foods with the boiling waters that come from the high pressure vents from the very core of Toril. If you wish to try okay. to do something with that, I would add, I would advise caution, but I, I shall not stop you. If you will uh, follow one of the gods to, I wanna, to the I kitchens. Wanna you, try. Could, you could give it a, your best shot. Um, I make no promises as to how it will work with your technique, but I am not an expert. I'm sorry. Well, if if I insert um, like a, a threading of iron in one of the like C things, and then I put another one on a spinny thing that spins fast enough. I can like friction weld them together, and maybe I can get something going. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go try. Uh, uh, great, uh, wonderful. Uh, did, did you want to hear what um, 
what I have learned. No. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> no. Uh, good, good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Fuck, okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> well, Anarella, you, you go to the kitchen. <laughs> you are led to the fucking kitchen. Where there is... I mean, she really... She she really fuck. I get it. I get it. I get it. You don't need to explain to me. But also, damn it. So, go. Damn kids. Here's already. I guess maybe I'll have to wait for next session. Or maybe we'll just go until four in the morning. We're probably not going to do that. Oh, but <laughs> I don't think. If nobody's like, bitch. <laughs> you slappy ass bitch. No. Lover's like, I'm done already. Excuse me. I'm working on my fucking comics. Do you mind? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and eating something that looks delicious? Just hush puppies? <laughs> oh. Tasty nuggies. Anarella. Mm -hmm. Fuck me. Give me a second. I'm gonna um make a constitution check while you fuck me, I guess. That's what I said out loud. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna recover. I'm going to at this point six hour trance we're going to take away one point of exhaustion for Tobovar and then we're going to make the constitution saving throw which we all know he's incredible at <laughs> so wait it's a is it still defense. a disadvantage? Our ability checks ah. mercifully the the uh, what was it level three was disadvantage on saving throws that's when everything went way downhill because it kept being constitution and that's just the fuck in the everything so straight roll <clears throat> could somebody please inform mondo that only one point of exhaustion was recovered Because no. Morgan's stinky pussy. <laughs> no, <laughs> we're not saying that. No way. <laughs> it's the name of it's. Fine, I'm a neutral. I'm the DM. It's up to the party to decide whether or not this concoction will be called that from this day henceforth. But. As a working title, <laughs> Morgan Stinky Pussy Bomb <laughs> has caused Tobovar to vomit in his sleep, in his trance. Oh, that's dangerous. Yes, it is. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, it is, because we've seen from Baldur's Gate how people trance, apparently, when they trance on their backs. So it's just like. <laughs> this this lucid dreaming state and then suddenly burble 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 that's not good it's very unpleasant to say the least so Nancy I trust you're typing it to them right now <laughs> that is its official name in my notes yes <laughs> wonderful nope so yes um, only one sadly the um, the effort, it was already kind of a tenuous combination of deeds to trance in the presence of the midnight oil in order to kind of double stack the restoration effects for exhaustion. So being made to fucking barf in the middle of a trance, in the middle of this rest. Trance happens over the course of this, but the midnight oil effect does not. Because okay. he got some of that nasty sniz. <laughs> sniz! <laughs> yeah. Great. Anarella, please. Mm hmm. That's all. 
<laughs> and real please. Uh, let's go to Apology. the level two. Let's see, 28 is the kitchen. So, I do you all just only see black? I don't know why it's doing this to me. Yeah, this it's is, all black. This is dumb and bad. Let me click on... <clears throat> You're not even on the fucking monk's toolbar. It's stupid. I tried refreshing it already. Let me go to the um, unnamed scene. Haha. <laughs> Uh, I come back. Here I come. I come. I come again. On occasion. Open the umbrella. Another drink. Fine. You buy? You drink. <laughs> I'm by. <laughs> I drink. <laughs> Just try to refresh again. In the meantime, theater of the mind. You go to the kitchen. It's up north. It's second floor, north. Guard leads you there. It's not Titus. It's some guard you never asked his name, and you won't. <laughs> you better don't. Um, you approach. You've been through this place before. You were led by Titus. Uh, on your first tour, you go to the kitchen that is just adjacent to the musical theater room with your, your friend, Pipe Crab. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the water in this pool is unreasonable. It is of a temperature that you have to work to achieve. Mm -hmm. You have to try your damnedest to muscle this sort of heat out of a furnace. Mm. It it would seem. You don't know what she meant by the core of Toril. I'll tell you what. Mm. Roll me roll me an intelligence check. That's that's just mean. Uh-huh. Listen, I play uh, Fanny. I know what it's like. I feel that feel. But you got a chance. Not the best chance. You don't know what that means. You think... You've heard your papa swear and say it. I've never seen such shit in all of Toru. <laughs> it's a big place. Whatever it is. Okay, so it's in the middle of that big place. Middle of big place, yes. There's a lot of heat coming from the middle of that big place. It would seem, because above table, obviously, there's some fucking geothermal bullshit going on here, and it is intensely hot. Yeah. And it is. I'm, I'm assuming a lot of the magic so to keep it to keep it liquid. <laughs> you were Anarilla. <laughs> You, of course, you. It's the ocean. <laughs> it's the ocean. Yeah. It, the pool stays liquid because there's a continuous source of water flowing into it. It's steaming. And there's... Let me take the third floor. Yes, good. <laughs> you see... A strange mesh... That is holding what appears to be... You can't see it, actually. Because the steam rising from this pool is just a continuous font of... Okay. Magic would, be, would have been an easier answer. But I think I... I guess I chose violence for myself. <laughs> Fucking magic did it! No, it's... <laughs> Let's just say it's, 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 it's okay. I'll I'll head cannon the shit out of it. In, in any way, mm -hmm. let's just uh, say it's fucking both. It's both, all right? Jeez, but Dana doesn't can, know that. She doesn't need to know that. I am what work, you are gonna I do? Can, like I, I feel it. Like I, mean, I can't work do? with that. <laughs> you f you feel it? Here. Yeah. How close do you get? Well, as close as I need to feel. Um, the heat? This is where the magic comes in. How close do you get? 
you can see that there is a there's wave there's this there's stink lines but he there's mm. there's Arizona road lines coming up Arizona road lines just the heat off the asphalt with a towards the back wall an opaque layer of steam just rising up okay and it curls over to block what you see what seems to be some kind of like net it's hard to tell we are familiarity with furnaces and forges makes it look like this is some, some kind of chimney mm -hmm. but Sixty feet. Yes. The ceilings are forty feet tall. Okay. There's water above you. There's just water above you. Mm. So this steam is escaping into the ocean. Into into water. <laughs> into twenty feet of water that you can see past this. <laughs> Fair. Yeah. Uh Okay. So, how close do you get? Well, I was like, with a hand in front of me, I'm like, still not hot, still not hot, still not so hot. So you are cautious. Still not hot. You, you, you know how yeah. to fuck around with fire. You know, you were told that this yeah. was hot. Fire hot. Fire indeed hot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Since you are smart enough, since you are practiced enough to exercise caution, you're smart in your way. I've singed away enough slime to know. <laughs> yeah, you boiled a bit at times. You, you learn. <laughs> and Anarella learns eventually. You... Even. Oh, oh! Yeah. You can work with this. This is intense. All right. Let's work. Okay, what do you do? I'm because... Gonna... Do. But she informed you as well, is that there's, there's no metal, there are no anvils here. <laughs> they didn't forge it's okay. the weapons. I have, I have metal. Um. Okay, okay I know what I want to do. I want to find. That was a really like love. The... Sorry, I I, I mm -hmm. love just like when she's like. <laughs> The pressures, the pressures of the ocean, can do a lot more work in tempering materials than most small folk smiths could ever hope to achieve. You're like, I don't want to say you're wrong, bitch, but <laughs> <laughs> wrong. Like, I can I can tell it's right on the edge of your tongue. It's just, it's right I know there. more than you. It's, <laughs> it was right the fuck there, but you, oh, but you showed oh, call you, you showed delightful restraint. So, <laughs> I've... Fuck, do you uh, have advantage? But, uh, no. Good. Anyway, go uh, on. Inspiration, you mean? Uh, inspiration, yes. Yeah, no, I don't. Um, Rad, go on. No, I'm just... Okay. Out. Take it. Just take take it. Sweet. Take, sweet, it, sweet, like, sweet. take it like cool, a good just boy. Um, yeah. Okay, I know what I, I, know what I want to do. I want to take um, my revenge I'm on those... I said it. I'm just looking at the name of the page. <laughs> I want I want to take my my revenge on those um uh like gauntlet slash like brass knuckles that I wanted to make for for Shidani. Ah right okay, sick. Please. So I want to. I want to take I want to take a couple <clears throat> crossbow bolts, <laughs> and I want to. Heat them to forging temperature to shape them the way I want to to make them like grips, and I want to um, set them in the hardest shell material I can see to make like shell brass oh, knuckles. Oh, right, because fucking bolts are all metal. They don't have a wood shaft, do they? No. Right. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, sorry, how are you, um, how are you shaping them? So, I'm going to find the hardest shell, shell material I can. And I want to chip it. Okay. 
in the sh in the shape that I want, which is going to be like a concave kind of dome like kind of stuff. And I'm going to set the bolts in that and shape them into handles to have okay, like shell brass knuckles. OK, so the most fragile part would be the, the covering. Well, if, I mean, depending on the hard, the hardness yeah. of the shell, they, have, they have some the most sea shit. I'm assuming there's something working. The most brittle is what I say. Not not the most fragile, the most brittle. Yeah. It's but also the hardest. Shells. But but the hardest. Yeah yeah yeah. Ceramic. And, and okay, all right, all right, all right. So the hardest shell. Okay. Let us do a thing. Let us take one of these guards. Your friends already. You're friends of Maelstrom, as was described, but you're led here and kind of under the supervision of the guard because you're doing, you're playing with fire, except water. Yeah. You're playing with them under the demi planes. Steam plane. It's always on sale. Why it's so lethal? <laughs> Where'd it go? Nobody's in the fucking place anymore. Okay. It's because I changed the location of all the icons. Everything <laughs> did a big break. So, giant. Giant? Giant. Mm. Right. Storm. Giant. You are looking to do those things. You want yeah. a hard shell. You want to shape the arrows, the bolts rather. You want to shape the bolts mm -hmm. into grips. And most yes. likely you want to do that after you get the shell. So that, honestly, for yes. you, just roll. Just, no, don't even. Do you want to roll? Do you want to roll? I'd use your pass. I want to roll. I want to roll because I want to find. Uh, weapon grade shelling, like mm -hmm. something that's, that's something different. that can actually be useful. That's a different. That's a different roll. For, yeah. for the bolts, for the bolts, uh, you want to roll for the bolts because I could just use your passive. I, the the part with that is just shaping the bolts into handles. I don't think that's really gonna be a roll worthy See, kind of stuff. I'm tempted to say that I would like to use. Your passive. No, this is different. You know what? This is different. This isn't a furnace. This mm -hmm. is an extremely okay. intense heat. It's a little bit different. So let's say make a just roll with your kit. Hold on, let me let me check your Let me check to make sure that your kit is using the right stat. Is using strength, I trust. Mm -hmm. Your tools. Your tool proficiency is using intelligence! <laughs> <laughs> Smistles. I wish I could. Actually, I could add one. I could add one. One is strength. Submit. I, I, uh, uh, did it just roll? Did I? Oh no, because I, cause I clicked it. Oh okay. And did it? it <laughs> and you see intelligence? You silly. We could say twelve, but no. I'm gonna add another one. Can you talk proficiencies. I can't double it? Oh, it's gonna make another roll for a different bonus. It's gonna make it between dexterity and strength. Bucket is strength, it's fine. Though, so, shit, it's not fine. Actually, mm -hmm. because of how this works, it's not a matter of strength. It's a matter of dealing with what heat source this is. So mm -hmm. this will be a dexterity check. It'll be an advantage, because you're good at what you do. But, it's still a dex check, instead of a strength check. Okay. So... You know how to handle the metal. You just don't know how to handle the heat source. At advantage. Yes. Oh my god, we are lousy with natural 20s tonight. This is wonderful. Yeah. This is, it's weird. But you kind of like it. This is, it's new. <laughs> with the, mm hmm. I understand that feeling, but this it's it's a weird source of heat, but it's it's forceful. It's <gasps> new forging shit. Yeah, you've discovered a new technique. Wherever this toral shit is, 
You gotta find out about it. Like, apparently, <laughs> you need Papa's to, like, know about this Toro. So they can, maybe, maybe this adamantine forge ain't that great. Because this Toro, whatever it is, whatever the center, is it spewing out all this heat? Fucking baller. Because you don't have to, you don't have to press it in. You don't have to, like, lean into the, the embers, into the coals. You don't have to use the bellows. You don't have to do anything. It's handled for you. And you just have to hold it there, and all this rising heat, this steam pressure God. that's pushing up, it just, cool. it just, ooh, it, you, ah, oh, here it goes. You got your tongs out. The tongs, the tongs are softening. You're like, whoa, hold up. All right. Oh, shit. <laughs> mm. Okay. All right. Ooh, this is good. Now, now that that's understood, certainly first, you would have asked the guard. Or look for yourself. Would you like to ask guard? Where's your hardest shell? Or would you like to just fuck around and find out? I don't want to ask him and look. Curious little bitch. Where's okay. my action? So, Where's my action? that Where's is why go? I brought out his... Yeah, this one's bumpering or something. So I can make the saving throw. See how much he loves you. Storm giant. How much does storm giant love? How vigorously does Storm Giant love? That's a lot. Oh my god. Oh yeah. He's a busy. About the size of a gourd? Nancy. We, we don't have time to get back into that. <laughs> I'm going I'm to stop saying words you can, to you before I say something I can't take back. You can have that conversation <laughs> later. That's happening after We know you're going to. Oh yes, we will. You can compare gourds then. Good idea. Uh, okay. Um, what do you say to this guardman? I um uh so I'm looking for a shell, but like from a thing that has a super mm -hmm. hard shell, maybe like like the crab outside, mm -hmm. and maybe like a uh, strong, something that can take a hit. Oh. Oh yeah. He's he uh. He, it's like he pulls it no, it's a great sword. Even, mm, yeah, even for giant, he takes. And you didn't really have the opportunity to inspect the craftsmanship of the weapons these giants have been wielding. He takes this great sword out, and it is, it has this subtle, curious, pearlescence to it. Mm -hmm. You see now that it's not metal. So like this. Something like this. I poke it. Boop, boop, ding, ding, boop. Ding. Mm, yeah. Quality. Yes, these are from... Where are they from? Ha. Huh. These are from the Pearl Sea Snails. They are massive creatures. Far larger than us. Oh, big ass snail! Oh yes. Is this the same I quality probably. as like flail snail shells? Nature check. <laughs> he doesn't know what that is. Okay. Well, I I'm don't if... know. It is. Uh, it is. It does definitely serve us well. It is. It is a brittle material. It, as in, it has no bending quality. I see that you know how to work with metal. Very impressive, small one. But this is not so malleable. It must be taken strip by strip, and it is rare to find such a flat strip as this. You notice that it, there is a little waver to it. It's okay. I can chip. Well, then, good. Roll a d100 for me, please. D100. Yes. If you're looking for stuff to satisfy on his fist, it wouldn't take much. So, hopefully, they're going to have some remnants. Don't roll below a 10. That's nice. 66. Exec execute supply order. <laughs> <laughs> execute supply order 66. Easy peasy. Let's go. So... 
You want some of this? That's just okay. You want some of this? You want, you want some of this? You want some of this? Oh, yeah. oh fantastic. Uh, uh, how much are you looking for? I'm not sure we really have all that much. If you're looking to make something of this size, I'm going to have to say that you are out of luck. It is as I, I show, said, difficult. I show but... him. I show him a crossbow bolt and uh, I say like something to go over it like this. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh! Right, of course, of course, right. Of course, you're not making these to our scale. Right, 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 right. Yes, yes, that is, of course, as uh, the, the, what is it the small folks say? Uh, easy pozizi. I think you got it. That sounds right, yes, I'll be right back. That's so fucking cute. Oh my god. <laughs> when you make friends with storm giants, they're adorable. Uh, uh, you, uh, I trust you know what you're doing. You will not hurt yourself. Do not fall in. You know what you're doing. Yeah, no, and I learned very fast you don't go in the furnace. <laughs> you're, you're cute. I'll be back. Thank you. Uh, just in case, though. Hey! Oh, Titus is gone. Uh, okay, don't fall in. I'll be back. And he, uh, he leaves. Comes back. You you fucked around with your with your bolts. In the meantime, mm -hmm. he comes back. He comes back with a with an oddly curled, like what I compare it to. It's like if you quadrisected a cornucopia. Mm hmm. You get something like that. You get, you get, it looks like very cutting room floor shit. So you get like chunks of this shell that look like that. It very much, you see like straight lines in it that seem to indicate that it was just barely outside of what was used to forge these giant sized great swords. It was, mm -hmm. it was just that just like they <clears throat> just caught the straightest edge that they could before it started to curve. Mm -hmm. It looks like that. So you, you got these. You got these titty holsters. You got lots of nice, lots of rainbow titty holsters. Pearlescent, sorry, not rainbow. I'm mm -hmm. full disclosure. I'm thinking of the rainbow shell from Chrono Trigger. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> but pearl instead. Must much more malescent. <laughs> Okay. And here you are. So, you wish to shape it for Shidani's fists. Yes. Shidani's downstairs drawing. But you tried before. You know yes. the approximate size. I got the I got the and measurement. In fact, you you kind of got her knuckle impressions in you before. Yeah. <laughs> so, you get it. Is it should be easy enough in this case. Now that you know what you're you don't even need the heat. Well, you, you will need the heat in order to soften the metal again, in order to involve it in the shell. But, mm -hmm. you want to chip it just, just her, just her fisting proportions? Her fisting specifications? Yeah. <laughs> no one in the party knows what those are yet. Yeah. Actually, before, yeah. before I begin, mm -hmm. before I begin shaping it... Mm -hmm. I want to do a, because I do have some malleable metal in the form of gold pieces. <laughs> you sure do. Yeah. Can you get decorative? No, actually, I want to get practical. Fucking prove it. I want to do... Since I have very, very hot water at this position, mm -hmm. I want to do a melting coat of gold. Very thin, mm -hmm. but so that when I chip it, if any cracks happen, it makes it uh, stronger instead of weaker. Randy would be so proud. 
Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Yep. It's just make sure this one doesn't get possessed by a lich. <laughs> this is the season of the lich. Okay, well. That's a delicate process. I'm a delicate girl. That just I, happened. I to really be wish strong you enough to lift people. Wouldn't lie to me, but. <laughs> <laughs> Subtlety and Grace is your middle name. Indeed. Okay, make make an intelligence check. Or <laughs> Or with this source, still dexterity check, either at advantage. The answer is obvious, of course. With this missing tools? No. Dexterity. Okay. Just trade dexterity. Yeah. Eleven and one. The DC wasn't very high. Okay. I just wanted to see just how good you were at it. I'll keep that in mind. Can you take these numbers down for me? I'm gonna need to refer to it later because this is a really cool process and I really like it. You're this. I'm gonna have to dig into Baldur's Gate three for this because I really like like the the minor mm -hmm. permanent stat boosts that these do, and this will do that. Yeah, you're fucking you're sure. making cestus for Shidani that are gonna go on top of the chains she already has that have been flummoxing mm -hmm. me and DMD beyond for this long. <laughs> dimma, 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 uh, dimma. But okay, in fact, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you for some feedback on this, Librilla. I'm going to see where you want this to go. Okay. So, yes, mark down the number, 11. We're going to call that mm -hmm. we're going to call that a success, but simply yeah. a success. Okay. So then, to chip the shell, Smith's tools. Roll it. Roll it straight. Normal? Mhm. Mm Cuz this Wait, is this is their fucking that's job. The wrong Nope, that's strength. Yeah, that's the right stat. That's the right stat. We're in there. That's exactly what we need for this. It's not so much dex. You gotta, you gotta take the fucking chunk out of this pearlescent shell, the pearl snail shell. Mm -hmm. It's legendary creatures. Deep sea creatures are absolute nightmares. This shell is crazy. <laughs> you wouldn't believe. You've fucked with crystals before, and they they're hard, but they're brittle, and ultimately they're fragile. They cave to your pressure. This, you gotta work for it. Mm -hmm. Were it not you? I was looking for a 15. <laughs> this, this was a hard one. This is a quite a difficult one. You got it. You chipped it. Yay. You found, you found the right. All right. So I got a perfect shape. handle with like the, <laughs> the 24. Mm -hmm. Then the, the golding process is serviceable and then okay the shaping is okay so what are you doing to the the surface are you, are you doing metal spikes upon the surface or are you just leaving it to be the hard force the blunt force uh well if there are any like protuberances already present on the shell i'm not going to remove them but otherwise no i don't need okay. to shape Good. Yeah, yeah. So, you, yeah, you're not going to spend the... Honestly, it would be many more hours that, to try would, to sand would, down any perturbances. She, she, knows, she, she knows it would weaken it more likely than like do any good. She's yeah, a good that smith. coat? Yeah, of course. Red. I have to know. I have a fucking book on metallurgy, just like collecting dust on my bookshelf for a long time, and I never read it. Have you actually studied metallurgy? A little bit. Fucking nerd. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. This I, I love the word nerds. Probably should have fucking read that book so I could be like, oh yeah. 
Oh yeah, you're right. But what if? Wait, you're all higher than that. So what if? <laughs> <laughs> if I knew more about the process, then I'd be like, ah, you do something nah, even you better. Go. I yes and my players. So that was the last year of process, I believe. Uh, well, the last thing I guess is just putting the handles in. Okay, with all you've done so far, it's going to be pretty low DC. Make your fencing tools rolls. Okay. Because it's the combination. It, you're going to be fucking with the, the vents once again to get the ends nice and good. 20. Fucking done. I'll do. Absolutely done. Yeah, so like I said, take notes on what numbers these were. This is... This is great success. So, we will speak about any feedback you might have on this Librilla later, but for now, what I want to say <laughs> is that this would... If you wanted to use your strength instead of your dex as your modifier for your attack, you could do that. And it would be equal. Your strength would equal your dex modifier for these particular weapons. And and this is a lot of successes. I think if you they're only on the front, right? They're only the cestus. It's not like on the back of the wrist. Back of the hand, back of the wrist. None of that. It's the grip. Brass knucks. It's just cestus. The shape the shape I'm right? imagining is Curves. is you know like kind of a half boxing glove that you hold in with the bar in the middle. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Open hand sparring gloves. Yeah. Okay, so it covers the back of the hand. Well, by necessity, because, uh, because yeah, it's so just, brittle. Just a little bit, just a little bit. It's going to be... Okay, so it's going to be over the, over this part of the fingers. And just kind of cover the back of the knuckle. So if you open your hand fully, it's going to try to dig into the back of your hand. A little bit, yeah. Okay. All right, so they... Because the, the main coverage that's really important and where it needs to be the strongest is around the knuckles. I might want to say something like uh, any acrobatics checks that rely purely on your hands will be given a minus one. Because you can no longer open your fingers quite as wide. But your strength check would be equal to your dex check in, in cases that that would matter. Like, it would help you with a grapple, because you can force your way through their, their grip. And you can't, you know, as you would usually slide your way in and out of somebody's grip to escape with your decks. If you were to try to grapple someone, you can subdue their joints with the hard edge of these cestus. So, yeah, that would be one case where the strength would be the same as your decks would matter. We can revise this as we go, but this is my first, my first thought. And, because, I mean, one benefit, one detriment. As a reaction, you can make an attack roll against your opponent's attack roll. Punch his punch. And you will do damage equal to the margin. Using your strength. You might have to revise the first quality then. That's really strong. <laughs> Holy shit. I like it. It's a reaction. Yeah, it does use it. Reaction. So, yeah, it does use it. So, right. I think we'll talk if we must, but I think that's. That's good. Like I said, that was a lot of successes. 
thank fuck your friends on Maelstrom, because that should have cost you a lot of money. Mm-hmm. <laughs> thank fuck Sarissa and her guards love you for <laughs> being very much on the way to saving her fucking father. Uh-huh. <laughs> now, if you come back empty handed, well, we might have other we might have conversations money. to have. But, <laughs> but for now, yes, please make a note of that. That is the working features of this particular item. What are you calling it? Uh... Or, Librilla, what are you calling it? It's your. It's gonna be yours shortly. When she finishes. I mean, I'm gonna have to think about it. Okay. <laughs> I know what to call it. What are you gonna call it? Because they're because they're hand pads and. Okay, I'm calling them the Krabby Patties. Oh my fucking. <laughs> So legitimately, thank you everyone for hanging out tonight. <laughs> everyone got a lot done. You have all gained the benefits of a long rest for doing your work in the midst. Well, not Anarella, because you left. Mm-hmm. It's okay. I didn't, I didn't need one. And yes, Tobovar? Yes, Tobovar. Tobovar got the trance. Tobovar Tobovar got one. Tobovar didn't get the benefit of the candle. But Tovar did get the benefit of the trance. Or the, okay. the oil, rather. Tovar did get the benefit of the trance. Um, but he's still at one, though, right? Yes. Yes. Because just, okay. just the one thing happened. Good news, everyone. I have two spell slots. Good news! We'll take away that restoration from Tovar. And Morgan Stinky Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> it's my best work ever. Mm-mm. It's my best work ever. I will reach into Tobovar's bag of holding and take out <laughs> the box containing the Orb of Devastation please, and please open do. it. Please do. Don't oh my do god, it. please do. Please, He's please. If that give name me more to work with. Please fuck with <laughs> Tobovar's balls. <laughs> <laughs> Because there's more than one Shidani, in there. Shidani, 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 Shidani. Yes, bounce, bounce, yes, bounce. yes, yes. You'll have the opportunity to present. Here you go. Present with gift, Shidani. Yeah, you're coming at coming upon the end of the drawing. You uh, you just finished. Um, what was the last thing I... you had dealt with? You had just finished. Oh God, you just finished actually drawing Anarella, drawing Anarella with the the lingering bones of. <laughs> Lord Emperor Captain God Dryland <laughs> just floating inside the so, little Halloween decoration that is Anarilla. Oh, <laughs> drop the devil. When we were at your big cave place with the boss senseis, uh, I tried to make some for you, but I, I fucked it up, so mm-hmm. I melted it again, and now I tried again because mm-hmm. they have. A forge, but it's weird. And I made these. Oh, well, thank you. It's for your fists. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you, you, okay, here, you put that, and, you, and then and you close your fist on it. Yeah, you grab the uh-huh. handle like this. Yeah. And you see yeah, how yeah, it no, goes over it. Your, your this part of the <laughs> fist? And, and then, yep. okay, so now punch, punch me. <laughs> oh. Okay. Do, um, do you put your whole ass you into it? Or... Yeah, I would say um, so. Uh, roll, roll dex and we're going to call it strength. Just for the, the mechanical flavor of it. Roll your, your regular attack. With your fist. My unarmed strike? Yes. For the sake of Come mechanics, on. we are going to... Rep- oh, we my go. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Fuck. Oh my god. This is also magical damage. So, um, Anarella. Punched Anarella in half. How do you feel about oh. this? You just took 12 damage from a... Um, I... I guess. <laughs> just fucking... I, I, I did I put my... I, I, feel, into- uh, I, I, feel, I feel the blow, like, for real, for real. And I'm, uh, like, I'm, I'm, I'm like, happy with like, myself. And yes, also, we did it! <laughs> and and I, I, was, I, 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 I super sell it. 
Like, <coughs> so you you full ass the, the Dwayne the Rock the Johnson it. <laughs> yeah. Just just sell the stunner. Do a little do a little mm-hmm. flip on the on the mat. <laughs> Two of the ribs inside of her are broken now. Oh, the ribs are gone. Oh, they're all gone by now. Darn. But a lot of the the pink um, coral bread is on the wall. <laughs> so, yeah. That's what's gonna make her mad. Like you super sell gonna... it, but you didn't have to try very hard because it yeah, it splattered yeah, a yeah. lot of you. It splattered a chunk of like it, it. It skipped the armor. It was just like, uh, yeah, okay, face. Just <laughs> <laughs> the cheek is gone. <laughs> Nobody's never good. asked me to punch them. I didn't expect you to hit me in the ear. Shadani, 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 that was so cool. That was so, that was so good, dude. Okay, so don't don't show it off too much, or everybody else is gonna be super jealous because now you're you're like super overpowered. So like like just, <laughs> but but it's it's my gift for you. Yeah, now. My God. Now you're overpowered. Yeah, now you are. Thank you. Oh, shit. Oh, incidentally, Shidani, uh, during this time, if you would like, because uh, you've been drawing a series of images, but it's been eight hours. It didn't take you all that long to draw all the things you wanted to do. Because you went, you went like very pastel, broad pastel strokes for a lot of the stuff. If you would like to take this time to spend up to three of your key points to bank them, into your chains. You may. Just please make a note of it yeah, somewhere. Because I have been flummoxed on doing that particular feature with the items. <laughs> oh my god. So you, yeah, you have the opportunity to plug in three extra key points. Like banking spell slots, or at least sorcerer points. Jelly. Yeah, there's a reason I don't give right. it to you. There's a second resource. Log. Oh yes, that's right. Boundary has that available for you. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, that's one of the modules I got where you can add infinite. Maybe it's not infinite, but you can add many, 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 many resource tabs. Perfect. Wonderful. Sarissa, we'll have to fucking wait. We are way over time. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for your patience, especially Labrilla. I know your dogs are just being little brats. So thank you so much for waiting. I know I kept you too long because Lola's making a cool thing for you, and that's rad. I want you to have a treat. <laughs> so we will see you all next time. Everyone in chat, thank you so much for hanging out for our investigation and RP heavy session. <laughs> and I guess heavy gourd related session. Mm, it's really heavy in the palm of your hand, you know? <laughs> just it's just weighty. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so so where do we There's go? a channel that just plays episodes of Alf. That's dumb. We're gonna go rage from. Silly. That's silly. <laughs> or ooh, good Jared. Oh no, he's playing Jackbox Party Pack. Found my new favorite Twitch channel. Sorry. I could also know. raid Mr. Scoot. He was playing Gunpla. Oh, that's cute. Oh, sweet cheeks. And on. record. So if you don't listen tonight, he's gone forever. Oh yeah, because the no vod for right, He yeah, doesn't yeah, do vods yeah. for tonight. Yeah. He's just been in there for like three that's days. Fine. That's uh. We have options. Oh, Pop Elf. Pop Elf is streaming. Pop Elf is so fucking hot. Oh my god. Hmm. <laughs> Fortifier is playing Darkwood. Giggity? <laughs> oh, wait, I know that game. But it's creepy. It's a good. I don't know how good it is. I never played it, but I've seen it. <gasps> no! What the fuck? What am I thinking? No, the answer is obvious. The answer is obvious. Oh, so many people are streaming right now. Oh, what a wonderful Sunday. Sunderful fun day. We are going to raid. Thank you, Nancy. Thank you very much, Nancy, mm-hmm. for facilitating that. I still haven't fixed my bot. We're gonna raid. Yeah, we're good. Mm-hmm. We're gonna raid. Our best good boy. Our swarthy, sensual. Elegant 
charismatic minotaur. Eddie Fuerte! Motherfucker Mario is yeah. streaming right now. He That's is playing amazing. Super Mario World and everything, so let's go raid that man. Oh, I miss his charming ass so much. So let's go. Let's go say hi. Let us, uh, let us recover. Oh, and he's, he's being Mario. Oh, he's keeping the Halloween spirit alive. What a good boy. Let us give him some love. Physically, emotionally, spiritually, polyamorously. Yay. So, this upcoming week. No drums! Fuck, no drums! Oh, god damn it. We have such a fucking cliffhanger for drums. Saturday, I will be going to Haunted Palace, but we will be doing Storm Riders or Vampire? Storm Riders. God damn it. I love Storm Riders, I know. but... <laughs> fuck. Oh, honey, you good sucky so boy. Oh. No, no, oh, I wanted to do... I wanted to do Vampire two, two weeks in a row, and it missed two weeks in a row. This, this sucks more than vampires typically do. Oh, <laughs> you guys. Good games. Cheese. Uh, yes, anyway, so we'll see you maybe next Sunday. Actually, probably not next Sunday. It might be a completely tabletop RPG for me. No, we have Storm Riders. We have Storm Riders that will save us. We'll see you then. Toodles. Ah. Bye.